Hi everyone. Happy early stream. It's 3 p.m. and I am here. <laughs> Hi, I hope you're all doing well. Sorry to uh, show up early and surprise you. I did announce it in the Discord and I mentioned it briefly yesterday, but hello. Let me triple check that my video is indeed scheduled <laughs> because usually it would go up. Okay, it is up. I was going to say, usually I post the videos right now, so let <laughs> me just make sure. But otherwise, oh, look! Anyway, my, my million subscriber plaque came today. <laughs> I'm very excited! Little Duca- oh wait, that was yesterday. <clears throat> I was gonna thank Little Duca for the bits because I saw it in my stream labs, but that was 20 hours ago. <laughs> Um, anyway, my million subscriber plaque came today. <laughs> and I'm just, I'm, I'm very excited. I also have that one and that one. Now I have three. Can we see it? I made a whole video on it today. Um, I'm gonna leave it in the background for now because she looks beautiful. But mere seconds ago, I posted a video on it. So, <laughs> if you want... You here? Let me let me see if I can find a um a part of the here. Um, there. That's what it looks like. <laughs> oh, let me fix my game capture as well. Yes, I am early because today. Well, I'll explain. There's a lot going on today. <laughs> there is a lot going on today. Um. <laughs> Whimsical, thank you for the two months. Blueberry, thank you for the bits. Casey with the two months. Mary with the two months. Thank you all so much. We are live early today because today, I don't know if you knew, but yesterday our stream was sponsored by Nickelodeon. Um, today <laughs> is the Kids' Choice Awards Orange Carpet. This stream's not sponsored by Nickelodeon, but at six, so in exactly three hours from now, um, there's going to be an Orange Carpet live stream. Um, and I, I don't want to stream through it. <laughs> um, it's pre-recorded, like I filmed it like a week or two ago, um, but that's being streamed today at six in exactly three hours. So I went live a little bit early so we could still do a three hour stream, but also like be live and ready to watch the, the Nickelodeon one at six. So that's why we're here early. Also, I'm seeing in chat that it's a bunch of your birthdays. Happy birthday. Um, <laughs> Hot Sphinx, thank you for the four months. Liam, thank you for the 16 months. Thank you all so much. Yes, I did just upload a video. You were right. Addy, thank you for the eight months. Green Pencil, thank you for the eight months. Raven with the two months. Rat with the six months. Whimsical, thank you for the two months. Thank you all so much. You can say Frisbee now. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on, let me sing this birthday song. <sighs> anyway. Um, the stream, you know how I was telling you all that, like, I had, like, a bunch of these calls with, like, a company for this thing that I was working on, um, and they told me that Frisbee was a copywritten word, and as an example, they were like, hey, try not to mention any brands, like, in the recording that we're gonna do, um, and they, they told me that Frisbee, for example, um, is, is, like, a brand. You know how we use Frisbee as, like, a generic term? Um, Frisbee <laughs> is a brand. The actual item is a flying disc. But I was, we, we've made jokes about Frisbees for like two weeks. Um, yeah, like Kleenex, same thing. Band-Aid, um, all that. Even I learned from chat that Escalator used to be a brand. Um, but stuff like that, <laughs> where it's like a, a word that's like kind of like the word, but it's not the official one. Like bandage is what you should say instead of Band-Aid, but a lot of people just say Band-Aid. Um, anyway, so that company that said I couldn't say Frisbee, is Nickelodeon. <laughs> and the thing that I couldn't say Frisbee in is being streamed on Twitch in three hours. <laughs> yeah, Q-tips are another one, yeah. Um, anyway, we're gonna play a little bit of Stardew Valley today. So, <laughs> welcome back everybody, it is good to see all of you. <laughs> Um, Aaliyah, thank you for the 20 months. Ray, thank you for the 12 months. Mackie, thank you for the 24 months. Oh my goodness, thank you all so much. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, Fluffy, a Prime sub and, like, a regular sub give me the exact same amount of money. I don't make less money from a Prime sub versus, like, a, a paid sub. I, I still get my cut of a Prime sub as if you would sub with real money. So don't feel bad if you're subbing with Prime. I get the exact same amount of money with Prime subs as I do with, like, regular ones. It's the same thing as a real sub. It's just free for you. <laughs> Which works out really well. <laughs> um, Danda, thank you for the bits. Aaliyah, thank you for the 20 months. 
Pog doesn't stand for anything, Amber. Um, Pog is a reference to a Twitch emote called Pog Champ. It's not like a acronym or anything. Lauren, thank you for the six months. Listen, thank you for the 27 months. Thank you all so much. Uh, but the emote is Pog Champ. Uh, all one word, capital P, capital C. Like two words together, no space. Um, but I think, it does it stand for play of game? It might. But I, no one uses it that way. Maybe it does stand for that. That's not what anyone uses it like anymore. Player of the game? Oh, I didn't even know that. Well, as far as chat's concerned, it doesn't stand for anything. <laughs> as far as you're concerned, there's not like a weird secret you're missing. Um, pog just means pog, you know? <laughs> anyway, um, now I'm embarrassed. Haley, thank you for the 12 months. Lizzie, thank you for the 27 months. Sarah, thank you for the sub gift. Thank you all so much. Um, anyway, so we played this farm last Saturday for 12 hours, <laughs> if you missed it. Um, so you might not have caught the whole stream, um, but we're currently on summer of year one. It's the 9th of summer. Um, we've got a lot of money. We're doing the Joja Mart route. This is our, like, evil save of Stardew Valley. I intend to date everyone all at once um, and cheat on them all. <laughs> at once. I'm not dating anybody yet, but we're close. Um, so I intend to cheat on the entire town, um, which is quite evil. Um, <laughs> I'm also going to do the Jojo Mart route instead of the community center. Um, so we're working on that. I've got this farm all set up here. So we've got a bunch of stuff going on. We are slowly but surely upgrading our tools and whatnot. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's the situation. So welcome to the stream. <laughs> We have, again, slowly but surely been working on this. <laughs> um, luckily, I have all my sprinklers now, thank god, so we don't need to, like, worry about getting more sprinklers or anything. Um, <laughs> uh, El, thank you for the two month resub! Thank you, Megan, with the bits, uh, Asta with the bits, Ingo with the five months, Butterfly with the bits, Angel with the two months, Neo with the 28 months, Gracie with the six months, thank you all so much. Okay. <laughs> Pro streamer equippy? No way. Okay. <laughs> I shan, by the way, also. Um, your sim has a crush on Skyla from my legacy challenge. Oh, nice, Emma. Skyla was actually made by Shella in the chat. I don't know if you, um, you probably know who Rochella is, but Rochella is a friend of mine and a mod. Um, and she, she's the one who made, wait, you said Skyla. No, Skyla's, Skyla was not made by Shella. False alarm. False, no, 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 no. Skyla's, no. Sorry. The new sim that was in my last episode that my sim is going to possibly date was made by Shella. Skyla is my sim's mom, and it was not made by Shella. Um, anyway, so Stardew Valley, am I right? <laughs> Mercurius, thank you for the prime sub, Gamer, thank you for the sub, Joanne, thank you for the bits, Emma, thank you, for oh god. Okay, um, I'm gonna harvest myself some of these really fast, and now I have some more of these that I can place, um, and I'm just gonna pretend that this isn't happening. <laughs> can I give Haley another gift today? Oh, I should be able to give Haley. Okay, we'll bring, we'll bring this sunflower to Haley. Anything else that I can give people as gifts today? Like I said, we're slowly but surely trying to give gifts to everyone <laughs> to make everyone love me. Yes, I'm early, Sailor. I'm early today because we have a special thing happening at 6 o'clock. Um, I don't know if you remember, but that, the Kids' Choice Awards, like, orange carpet. This, this stream isn't sponsored, by the way. Um, but the Kids' Choice Awards orange carpet, that's happening, um, in a little bit. That's happening at 6 o'clock. So, we are live a little bit early so that we can still go there and watch it, but I can also still stream for a full three hours, you know? Okay. Anyway... I don't have any money. <laughs> um, so that's a problem. Otherwise, though, let me go look at the... I need to go to the wiki so I can make sure I'm caught up. Because today's the 9th. Tomorrow is Maru's birthday. The 10th is Maru's birthday. Okay. So we're not missing anything. I just want to make sure. <laughs> uh, I just need to make sure we're all set up and good to go. You know? <laughs> um... Anyway, okay, I'm just gonna run around and see if we can collect any, like, 
materials while we're- Oh, I should probably- If I'm gonna chop things, I should chop my own farm. Tyler, thank you for the bits. Brett Braid, thank you for the five months. Oh, that's exciting. Also, um, Comrade Tyler, thank you for the nine months. Katie, thank you for the ten months. Thank you all so, so, so much. Um. <laughs> okay. Hello? No? I would like a cute girl to bring me a red mushroom. Alright, Sam. <laughs> I'll try. I actually might have one, maybe- Ooh! A salmon dinner! Speaking of Sam. <laughs> okay. Who likes salmon dinner? I'm gonna check the wiki. Possibly- <gasps> Alex loves it! Oh, perfect! No. I'm gonna go see if I have a red mushroom. <laughs> I'm gonna go see if I've got a red mushroom really fast. Catherine, thank you for the bits! You got this! I believe in you. You're gonna do great. You're gonna do wonderful on your exam. Um, Chelsea, thank you for the bits! Thank you so much, everybody. Um... Should I save it for Alex's birthday? Well, Alex's birthday... That's a good- honestly, that's not a bad... What? The wiki is broken! <laughs> Says sorry the site is experiencing technical difficulties. <laughs> ah. The wiki is down. <laughs> is it on the thirteenth? Birthday on the thirteenth? Okay, we can give um Alex the. Is it the summer thirteen? Right. I'll give it to Alex on his birthday then. That's a good point. Honey, thank you for the prime sub. Clara, thank you for the two months. Des, thank you for the bits. Sailor, thank you for the bits. Uh, Benty, thank you for 11 months. Thank you all so much. It's not for you. Well, I was on it a second ago, and now it's doing this. So, <laughs> it might only be certain pages, but, um... Well, <laughs> I don't care if yours is fine. Mine's not working. <laughs> so, take advantage of it while you still can, apparently. Because it'll be going down soon, maybe. Okay. Do I have a red- Oh, I do have a red mushroom. Perfect. Kelsey, thank you for the three months. And thank you for the bits. Um, they probably aren't both down, but it's fine, Anne. Don't worry. I got people in chat that can help. Um, I am sure we'll be fine. Kelsey, thank you for the two months, Cinnamon. Thank you for the bits. Um, thank you all so much. <laughs> okay. That's true. Actually, you can see their birthdays in-game, but we can't see the, like, loved and liked gifts anymore. With, unless you've given them one. Like, I can only see the gifts if I've given it to them. But you can see their birthday in-game now. Um, should you fish or mine right now? Go mining, Blueberry. That'll be fun. Go mining. Ooh, another cutscene. Ooh, Infinity, thank you for the sub, Shelly. Thank you for the sub gift. <laughs> Come in, Jojo, I want to show you something. Okay, Miss Gems, thank you for the four months also. Thank you so much. My secret hobby. Now sit back, sit back, relax, and allow yourself to be carried away to a better place. <laughs> okay. This is one of my favorite cutscenes. I know there is gators. I don't have any mods. I'm not that concerned about it. I know most of their loved gifts, like, by heart already. Um. <laughs> Cake, thank you for the prime sub. <laughs> Miss Gems, Miss Bell, thank you for the subs and bids, too. <laughs> Four months, Miss Gems, thank you so much. I like the song, it's nice. I like this game. I feel like I'm being hypnotized. I mean, it's not a bad thing. Oh, Connelly Ray, um, congratulations. That's awesome. I'm glad you got a good grade in the final. That's wonderful news. Um, say nothing and do a slow clap. Okay. <laughs> um, oh, sorry. I'm texting my parents back. I said, I told my parents that the Nickelodeon thing is today at six o'clock, right? And my dad said, this live or the recording you did? So I had to answer the question. 
<laughs> Don't mind me. Nixon Starshoot, thank you both for the resubs. 18 months, Lil Nixon. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, <laughs> um, and Des, thank you for the bits. Reminds me of Squidward's wavy arm scene. It kind of does. <laughs> Honestly, you're right. Okay. I'm gonna go give Haley a gift. Here you go, Bessie. Um, I don't have a present for anyone else. So, anyway. Maddie, thank you for the 12 months. <laughs> ah, I'm stuck. Sorry, went the wrong way. Alright, Sam should be in his house as well. I don't think I have two hearts with Sam, though, so I can't go into his room if he's in his bedroom. Yeah, I can't go into his room. <sighs> I'll just wait. <laughs> That's fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> Oh, now we just have to wait a while. Get him Joja Cola. Well, I have to give him um, this mushroom for a quest. But if we can find him some Joja Cola, that would be nice too. <laughs> yes, actually, Bagel Bites, I do have an update on my TikTok ban. TikTok replied to my tweet. I tweeted them again last night, begging them to please unban me because they banned me for no reason, like a week ago. And they said on Twitter, Thanks for your patience with us while we investigate. Rest assured your concerns have been escalated and a member of our team will follow up as soon as possible to assist. So finally, they gave me the attention I deserve. <laughs> Usually on their Twitter, they just reply with like, fill out this form, fill out this form. But it sounds like this is an actual reply because I said, I was like, I already did the form, unban me. <laughs> Um, so hopefully they'll actually, like, look at it and unban me, because I didn't do anything! I didn't do anything and I still got banned. Anyway, it's fine. Doesn't Alex like these? Nope, can't give it to him anyway. <laughs> okay. I am having a great day. Thank you, ghost. I hope you're having a good day, too. Um... Anyway, it just took me complaining a lot on Twitter to finally get TikTok to respond and hopefully unban me. <laughs> I don't know, Lemon. I'm I'm sad that I have been locked out of TikTok. I want to come home. <laughs> Wait, Sierra, did I open the 100k plaque with the same scissors? I guess I would have. I've had these purple scissors for a long time. Did I really open it with the same scissors in the other video? Oh, that's kind of cute. <laughs> that's funny. Um, Julia, thank you for the eight months, by the way. Thank you so much. Um, who are we raiding? Bugs, we're not gonna raid anyone yet. <laughs> I've only been live for 15 minutes. I'm gonna be here for about three more hours. <laughs> and then we'll raid someone. <laughs> Um, Chunky, I was gonna post Noah's new house video today, but then I got given my million subscriber plaque, so I'm gonna post it tomorrow. Um, blame the plaque. But, <laughs> channels grow, but scissors are forever. <laughs> we are gonna raid Nickelodeon later, yeah, because of the, um, orange carpet and my, my moment. I am hosting the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards orange carpet. At six o'clock, so we're gonna raid Nickelodeon later. Um, but we calm down, we're not raiding anybody yet. <laughs> I just got here. <laughs> hey, speaking of raids, <laughs> thank you so much, Lady Alyssa, for the raid. I really appreciate that. I hope you had a good stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, perhaps Sam will come out of his room soon. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to see if I can find anything good, but so far I have not found anything good. Doesn't Sam work at Jojo Mart? He was in his house this morning, Stony. I don't think he's in there right now. Um, if anyone has access to the wiki, my wiki won't load. <laughs> um, but if anyone has access to the wiki and you want to look up his time- Oh, I can load Sam's page! It was just Alex that wasn't working. Okay, today's a Tuesday. Regular schedule, um, he's gonna go to the beach at 1.40. Okay, maybe I'll go, maybe I'll go buy some Joja Cola and I can give him the cola and the, the mushroom. So, time to crack open my guidebook. Yeah, I think, hang on. It's 
not in my room. Instead, it's right here on my desk. I thought it was in my bedroom. It's not. It was right next to me the whole time. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had it in my bedroom, but it wasn't. It was right, um, it was right there on the desk. So anyway, we have this. Who needs the wiki when you have this? <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, the JoJo building is disgusting, I know. The JoJo warehouse is quite upsetting. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Christine, old school. We don't need wikis when I have this. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go buy, because Sam should be going to, oh wait, I was gonna go buy him some JoJo Cola. Because I want him to love me. So, <laughs> yeah, me too, Declan. They give out PDFs when they like add new stuff. Um, so you can still have the new stuff as well. How do you get this game? This is a game on Steam. It's $15 on Steam. It's also on Switch, if you play on Switch. It's even on mobile. Pretty much any platform that you may play on, this Switch, th this game is on. <laughs> so. <laughs> Tesla, you know, all your favorite gaming platforms. Yeah. I thought the wiki said leaves his bedroom and walks to the beach by the fire pit with his brother, Vincent. Mama Llama, thank you for the sub. Is it free on Tesla? It comes with the Tesla? Wait, it, wait, it's free with the Tesla? And thank you for the two months. All you have to do is buy a Tesla and you can get the game for free. So. That's a possibility. <laughs> what a deal. <laughs> it's a real bargain. <laughs> well, I think I'm... Surely he's not at Jojo Mart right now, right? If he's in his room, I'm gonna be really upset. Well, is he at the Jojo Mart right now then? The wiki says he's gonna be at the beach. I'm never gonna find Sam. I'm gonna spend all day looking for Sam. <sighs> There's no Joy-Con drift if you buy Tesla. He's not in here either. No, he doesn't say doctor's appointment. It says regular schedule, Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, birthday. It's not his birthday. The wiki is outdated though, because some things changed in the, like, since the update, so. Look under deviations. What does. What do you mean? Saturday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. What? Where is he then? Day nine and twelve. Oh, it's day nine. Walks into town. I was in the summer tab, Lily. There's a deviation on the ninth. He might be, there he is. He was down here. I know it's Tuesday. <laughs> he doesn't do anything on Tuesday. I have the wiki open. <laughs> I know more about Sam than you do, genius. Look, I was confused because under the summer schedule, it's like Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, birthday, birthday, you know, so I was confused. It should be regular schedule, but there's a deviation on day nine and day 23. That was the problem. <laughs> okay, I have this for you as well. Thank you. Now, please be my best friend. Oh, money. That was good, actually. Thank you. Now we have two hearts with him. Perfect. That was not worth it. <laughs> that, was, that was way too much work for a very little return. <laughs> we did it though. It's fine. I'm gonna go just chop down trees on my farm. I'm not kidding. I'm just chopping things down. I'll feel better this way. 
Maeve, thank you so much for the bits. Um, have a great night. Um, thank you so much for the bits. I really appreciate you. Uh, M, thank you for the bits. Zeridia, thank you for the 16 months. M, Beth, thank you for the two months. Maya, thank you for the 11 months. May, thank you for the seven months. Thank you all so, so, so much. Okay. This weekend's your 20th birthday? I can sing you a song. Happy birthday. Uh, oops. I lost all of those things because they went across. <laughs> oops. You like my thumbnails the past couple days? Nora, I had fun with them. Um, I decided to just be ridiculous and see what would happen. And they both, I think, are quite funny. So... <laughs> Um, also, we're gonna marry, well, we're, we're gonna marry, I think, Abigail, and then divorce Abigail, and get Krobus to live with us, eventually, in this save. This is my evil save, so I'm going to date everyone, all at once. Like, I'm going to cheat on everybody, all at the same time. So, I think we're gonna marry Abigail, though, have kids with her, turn our kids into doves once we have them, to get rid of them. Um, and then divorce Abigail, uh, and then, and then, um, we will see about Krobus coming to live with us. <laughs> yeah, you can, there's, there's cutscenes that happen if you date all of the villagers and when they all find out, there's a cutscene. I've never seen it, so don't spoil it, I'll get upset with you. Don't say anything, including things about rabbit's feet! Shh! Um, anyway, when you say no spoilers, people still say things about rabbit's feet. I don't know why they do that. I say don't spoil it, and they're like, you can make it different if you have a rabbit's foot. Yes, <laughs> but don't spoil anything. Um, but yeah, there's a cutscene that happens when they all find out you're dating them all at once. Um, and I've never seen it, so I want to see it. So that's what we're gonna try and do on this. <laughs> Jennifer, thank you for the 12 months. Haley, thank you for the prime sub. Lenore, thank you. Eleanor, thank you for the 9 months. Bottle, thank you for the sub gift. Um, Addy with the prime sub. Shay with the 4 months. Jennifer, thank you again for the 12 months. Um, thank you all so, so much. Can you tell this is a sore subject? <laughs> I'm, like, really paranoid about spoilers, because I streamed this for 12 hours on Saturday, and every time I mention my plan, the whole chat- well, not the whole chat, there would be somebody who was like, well, just so you know, and then they would try and spoil it. Every time. Without fail. Every time. <laughs> um, but anyway, we're gonna try and date everyone just to see the cutscene, so that is our plan. Obviously, we're still working on- we're, like, we're not very far into the game yet, so, um, we're still working on building up hearts with everybody, but- Kayla, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you so much. <laughs> Booty, thank you for the 16 months. Maggie, thank you for the bits. I need answers. What do you mean turn the kids into doves? <laughs> Maggie, um, if you pay the witch, you can get rid of your children. You can turn them into doves. To get rid of them. Which is what I'm going to do as soon as I have to. I've never done it before, but this is my evil save, so I'm going to do everything wrong that I possibly can. <laughs> everything that I could possibly do to hurt people, you know, like cheat on them, divorce them, get rid of their children and turn them into doves. Um, <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> yeah, I think it costs like 50,000 gold to turn them into doves each. But I've never actually done it, so someone in chat might know the exact price better than me, but I'm pretty sure it costs like 50,000 gold-ish. Um, but someone in chat might know better. Someone in chat said prismatic shard. Oh, no, it's 50,000 to divorce. Okay, 50k to divorce, a prismatic shard to dove. <laughs> is that what it is? Um, Dino, thank you for the four months. Crayola, thank you for the eight months. Sulky, thank you for the two months. I've never done either. So maybe I just had them mixed up in my head. Sorry. <laughs> um, but there you go. 50k to divorce, uh, prismatic shard to turn your kids into doves. So. Chat knows better than me. I haven't done it before, so. <laughs> I couldn't tell you. I have not seen it. But I will see it. Soon. I'm quite excited about it. Yeah, this game is $15 on Steam and on Switch. If you're looking into buying it, it's not a very expensive game, but it's very fun. Blaze, thank you for the, for the four months also. Ugh, break the tree. Okay. I won't break the rest of it. I'm just gonna go back up to my house. Well, Bree, when I said chop down trees, I just meant, like, clear my farm. 
I know I said chop down trees and then I went and broke stones, but when I said chop down trees, what I really meant was I'm gonna go clear up my farm because there's a lot of mess on my farm that I want to clear out. So that's what I was really talking about when I said I want to chop down trees, was just I want to clear everything up because it's a mess. Um, but that's the plan. Okay, today is Wednesday the 10th. This is Maru's birthday, right? Chat, um... Yes, 10th is Mara's birthday, 13th is Alex's birthday, 17th is Sam's birthday. Okay. Um, I have a strawberry for Maru. For her birthday! Ooh, tomorrow is the Pelican Town Luau. I also have all these peppers. I'm gonna give these as gifts to people. I have these for Shane now. Although I probably should sell some of them. <laughs> um, maybe I'll sell, like all of those. I'll keep like five of them. That'll be decent, right? Okay, strawberry for Maru. Yeah, that'll be fine. Let's go. Should've saved cauliflower. Uh, Jordan? What do you think I did? <laughs> what do you think I did for the luau? Lauren, thank you for the 17 months. I'm three steps ahead of you. <laughs> um, <laughs> Thanks again, Lauren, for the 17 months, though. I got hundreds of hours in this game. Don't worry. <laughs> um, yeah, I saved a golden cauliflower to put in the thingy, so don't worry. Don't worry. Ronnie, it's discord.gg forward slash lilsimzy for the discord. You can just do exclamation point discord, um, and then it gives you the link. <laughs> Tori, listen, it's it's not your fault. I've been playing this game for like years and years and years, you know? Like, I'm just bound to be better than you. <laughs> I'm just bound to be better than you at this. Don't worry. <laughs> you wanna see the play button? Father Bold, look. I put them behind me to show- I made a video about the play button today, but I, I've got my, my play buttons all of them are on display. I've got two there, and I've got one there. <laughs> um, but I've got my play buttons on display. <laughs> I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. Um, I need to put it on the wall somewhere, but I don't really have anywhere to put it in here. So I don't know what I'll do with it yet. I'm not sure. We put it in Dan's office. <laughs> my million subscriber play button, I put it in Dan's office. Yeah. <laughs> My earrings are cute. Oh, thank you. These, Dan gave me these as a gift for Christmas, maybe? They weren't expensive. They're just from Etsy. Um, but Dan got me this as a gift for Christmas. So. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Christmas, I think. Yeah, people in chat know more than I do when I got them. <laughs> Chat's like, oh, those are your Christmas gift, actually? <laughs> That happens to me a lot. Sometimes I'll like forget something, like the like the specifics of something, and people in chat are like, "Actually, that was um in July." <laughs> like you all know better my life than I do. Sometimes <laughs> you know what I got for Christmas and I don't. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense though. Like if I had just talked about it kind of recently or something, and you saw, like <laughs> it's kind of funny though. Um. <laughs> No, Helena, Dan doesn't live here yet, but we applied for a visa over a year ago for him to move here, so he will be moving here eventually. He's just not here yet. Um, but yeah, Dan's in the process of moving here. He's just, again, not here yet. Um, I'm just killing time until I can get into Maru's place, so I'm just gonna kill some slimes while I'm down here. Because I'm trying to slowly but surely work on my monster slayer goals. <laughs> so if you can just kill, like, five slimes a day, you know? Then you're set. <laughs> He's gonna live here when he moves here, McKenna. That's sort of the whole point of us doing the visa process is so that he can move here. Um, all right, let's go up. <laughs> That's true. I like you all know like a small percentage of my life. You you know a few things that I've talked about, but I have so many more things to remember about myself than you do. So you can remember all the things that I tell you way easier than I can. <laughs> okay. 
I don't know. Am I close enough with Mario to go into her room? No, I'm not. When do you come out of your room? Oh, that's good timing. <laughs> when do you come out of your room, Maru? <laughs> right now. Can I sneak past her into her room? Oh, I did it. Oh my goodness. This is my Jojo Mart evil run, yeah. Just testing some soil samples, have fun. We might have two hearts with her now because I just gave her a, a loved birthday gift. So it probably went up a bunch. Jalen, thank you for the four month resub. Also, I can sing you a song. Yeah, happy birthday. Ooh, where's my mm, harmonica? Uh, oh, she's running. This is just year one on this save, Misfit. Thanks for helping out, Jojo. Yep, no worries. Maru's a good kid. She seems very nice. I wouldn't want anything getting in the way of her bright future. You know what I mean? Well, you think I'm gonna get in the way? Just some food for thought? What, just because I'm evil? You know what, he's right though. <laughs> I do plan on dating her and like 10 other people all at once. So yeah, fine, whatever. <laughs> uh, Karen, I'm gonna start uploading the Jojo Mart saves uh, tomorrow. I've got four videos from that 12 hour stream. You can watch them on Twitch right now though, if you want. The stream's still on Twitch, um, but I'll post them on YouTube starting tomorrow. In like four separate parts. <laughs> Matrix is weird. I don't like I don't like this. Right, Jojo? Actually, your dad was being I'm gonna say it. Actually, your dad was being weird. <laughs> what did you say to her? We were talking about you? I wanted to say a few things to Jojo about you, but I didn't want to embarrass you. I shouldn't have lied about it. Yeah, you shouldn't have been weird. <laughs> That's okay, Dad, I understand. Hmm. Well, that's nice. Okay, how many hearts do we, yeah, we have four hearts with Maru now. That jumped up three hearts. Yeah, all that on Maru's birthday too, poor Maru. <laughs> <sighs> okay. I am here to give, um, well, actually, I can't give Linus any gifts. I need to keep my gifts. Well, the first time you played, you wanted to marry Robin, and you don't like Demetrius because he's your husband. That makes sense, though. If you, like, didn't know that Robin was married to Demetrius, and you wanted to marry her, and then you found out that you couldn't because she's married to Demetrius. I mean, he stole Robin from you. You should hate him. Surely you can get a mod to marry Robin, even if you can't, like, technically marry her. Surely you could get a mod. Isn't there a mod where you can marry everybody? Even the, like, ineligible ones? Because, I mean... Yeah, I swear, like, everybody would want to marry Robin. <laughs> She's nice! Okay, I'm gonna kill the bugs while I'm here. I know I told you this, but... I'm trying to work on killing as many bugs as I can. <laughs> Um, I want to get my monster slayer rewards, so I need to kill a thousand slime, so. <laughs> Let me just kill a bunch of bugs. Oh, another one of these, too. The Duggies, I always, like, never bother killing them. I just kind of, like, walk past them in a lot of my saves, like, because you don't really need to kill them because they aren't, like, going to fly and get you. Just don't walk across them, you know? So I always am, like, super behind killing the Duggies, too. Ooh. Um, okay. They are kind of satisfying to kill, though. She's married? Robin? Yeah, she's married to Demetrius. Um. <laughs> okay. Ooh, there's one of those thingies. It's gonna give me some gems. 
Yeah, you have to kill so many death sprites, I know. At least there's like a bunch of them though. Like, cause they, they show up and there's like 10 all in one spot or something, you know? Okay. Yeah, it would be kind of funny if Robin was an actual marriage candidate, right? Because you can kill, like, or you can kill, no. You can marry Robin's kids, but you can also marry Robin. <laughs> I mean, nothing wrong with that. It would be kind of funny, though, if you dated, like, Robin and Sebastian at the same time. <laughs> Something about that gives me really bad vibes. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Abby, thank you for the 13 months. Oh, it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Can I sing you a song? <laughs> okay, I'm just here to kill as many slimes as I can. Thank you very much. Let me eat this. Musical Geek, so you can date people. Once you get to eight hearts with them, you can give them a bouquet and then it will make them your, your partner. Um, but you need to get to eight hearts with them first. So you can see all the villagers, you see how some of them have like a full 10 heart bar and some have just eight. Um, the ones with just eight are all the eligible ones, the ones that say single. Um, if you get to eight hearts with them, you can give them a bouquet and then it unlocks the other hearts and then you can get to 10 hearts and propose to them. Um, but the bouquet is what makes them, um, your partner. That is how it works. Is there any more monsters down here? Why are there no monsters on this level? Give me monsters to kill! Oh, have fun, Brad Fred. I'm so excited for you. Have a great time. Emma, thank you for the bits. Also, can you say hi to my little boy? Yeah! Hey, Jackson! Um, you're doing bedtime story while watching me? Oh my god! That's so cute! <laughs> I hope you're having a good day, both of you, Emma. That's really, really sweet. Thank you for sharing that with me. Um, and tell him I said hi. <laughs> um, McKenna, Dan lives in the UK. Um, <laughs> hence the visa process. Dan's family has a dog, but obviously he's not going to bring the family dog with him when he moves here to America. Um, <laughs> uh, unfortunately, Lottie will not be coming with him. <laughs> Dan doesn't have any pets of like his own though, you know? Um, don't worry. <laughs> he does not have to worry about them getting along with Snap because he will not be, that's not a thing. There are no pets to bring. Um, okay. Um, okay, I'm gonna kill some bugs now. <gasps> Another Juggy. die. Thank you. Yes, it is. Today is the Nickelodeon orange carpet. It's at six. I will, um, I'm, we're gonna raid them tonight, so don't worry, you won't miss it. <laughs> I'm gonna raid Nickelodeon. So if you missed it, um, I did a, sp a very exciting sponsor. Uh, I worked with Nickelodeon on something recently, which has been like the coolest thing ever. Um, but basically the Kids Choice Awards are tomorrow, and they've got like an Animal Crossing orange carpet, um, that I hosted, and that's tonight. Uh, on their Twitch channel. I already filmed it, like, it was pre-recorded. It's, like, an hour long. Um, but, uh, that's being streamed tonight at 6. So that's why we're gonna raid Nickelodeon today. I'm really excited about it. I'm also very nervous. I hope that it's not, like, awkward. Because I, like, I felt really awkward recording it, but that's because I was in a call with, like, 10 people. <laughs> there was, like, 10 Nickelodeon staff in the call when I was recording it, so I was really nervous about it, as you can probably imagine. Um, when I was recording, so I don't think it was awkward, but I, I just, I really hope it doesn't feel that way <laughs> when people watch it. And also, they, like, edited it, so I don't know how they edited it, but I'm, I'm sure it's good. I'm just nervous. <laughs> Girl Alert, thank you for the five gifted subs. Kalani, thank you for the bits. Kyra, thank you for the bits. Jack, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you all so much. Um, okay. No, I didn't get to talk to any celebrities, but I did get to, um meet Animal Crossing characters dressed up as celebrities. <laughs> um, so Kenan Thompson is hosting the actual Kids' Choice Awards, and obviously they didn't force Kenan Thompson to play Animal Crossing with me, but there's like a person dressed up as Kenan Thompson on the island. <laughs> Not to ruin the movie magic, um, but I like, basically I pretended to meet and interact with Kenan Thompson. 
<laughs> and also, um, Justin Bieber is doing a total music takeover. Their words, that's what they wanted me to say, um, at the Kids' Choice Awards. And, um, I got to talk about him too, but of course I did not actually meet Justin Bieber. I don't think that either of these people care that much about the Animal Crossing red carpet. <laughs> I don't think that um, Keenan or Justin are, are that concerned about the, the Animal Crossing orange carpet. <laughs> you gotta admit, I'm not sure this is um, a thing they find that valuable. <laughs> Although I don't know, maybe Justin Bieber loves Animal Crossing. You never know. <laughs> Sorry, orange carpet, my bad. <laughs> Lead singer, thank you for the two months. I'm really, really excited for you all to see it though. This has been really cool. It was a thing that I was really stressed about. Obviously, I was like really nervous about it. Um, like last week, I was really scared. <laughs> um, but it ended up being really good, I think. So I'm excited for you all to see it. I was just understandably very nervous. Because keep in mind, so I went to film it, right? I can kind of explain how it works now. But I went to film it. Um, and I was like in a Zoom call, uh, so there was like the person who's like hosting it and organizing it all, and she had like, it's her island, um, and she had it all set up and decorated for this like orange carpet, right? Um, so like she was in the call, there was like some other social media team people in the call, there was like six other people in the call who were there to like dress up as all the characters for the orange carpet part. Um, there was, like, a guy who's, like, the camera tech guy who was, like, on the island also to, like, get extra b-roll shots. Um, and I was sitting here at my desk and I was, like, recording my face and gameplay, like, how, how I would for a video, you know? Um, but I was also in a Zoom call with, like, ten people! <laughs> um, and I was, like, a lot of them were just muted, like, they are just there, um, just listening, like, as I was doing it. And so I was really nervous about it, because I felt really, like, awkward recording in front of, like, ten people, you know? And that's why I was really nervous, like, going into it, because it wasn't, like, my normal recording situation, because there was, like, all these people there. Um, but I think it turned out well. I think it's good. I just was really nervous about it, <laughs> you know? Um, but I think, I think it was really good. So, really a freshman. Thank you for the sub, by the way. Thank you so much. Um, I really appreciate that. But anyway, fingers crossed that it's, um, good. <laughs> and not awkward. <laughs> um, it got, like, obviously this kind of thing gets easier, like, as you kind of get, get into the zone, like, into the swing of things. Um, but, so, like, as I, as I was getting through it, it was getting easier. But, like, in the beginning, I felt really uncomfortable. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. I didn't know how to, like, start, you know? Um, but it got easier and, like, felt more natural the more I was- That's just how it works, though, right? Like, the more, like, as you get into it, it gets easier. But I was really nervous. <laughs> oh, this is good, actually. We really needed more infested levels because I'm trying to kill as many slimes as possible. Thank you very much. Okay, but Iguana, like, <laughs> sure, I talk in front of, like, thousands of people every day on stream, but that's not the same thing. Like, you're listening to me right now, and there's, like, a few thousand of you here, but it's not the same as, like, being in a call with ten people who are muted and listening to you, you know? Like, this does not feel like public speaking. That is public speaking. <laughs> you know, like, this to me, I'm just sitting at my desk, no one is in here. I'm just playing my games, you know? Like, this isn't the same thing as, as, like, talking in front of actual people. I can't see you, like, um, it's a lot easier to stream than it is to, like, actually talk in front of people. Um, I know it sounds similar, but it's not. It's not. <laughs> Take it from me, I got some experience. <laughs> yeah, and also, kind of like what you said, my, like, I guess the recording thing is different because they like picked me, so they definitely liked me. But you know when you like talk in public, a lot of times like when you public speak, like maybe in front of your class at school, like a lot of those people, you might not know them very well, they might not like you very much, you know, like it's like scarier because you're like worried about what they're gonna perceive about you, whereas most of you, most of you, <laughs> Some of you might not. Most of you already like me. <laughs> like, most of you are here because you like me, you know? Um, so, <laughs> it's, like, easier because we already like each other. <laughs> Some people here don't, but that's not my problem. Nosy, thank you for the two months, and SJ, thank you for the sub. <laughs> oh, Gail, people definitely hate watch. 
you know? I, it, it happens. Everyone does it sometimes. There's bound to be someone here who doesn't like me. <laughs> They're listening right now. They're like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Level seven mining. Nice. Okay, 600 gold. That's not very good. <laughs> Kirby, thank you for the bits. This is hate bits. Wow, thank you, Kirby. Um, Nosy, thank you for the two months as well. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay. Fortune teller. Um... <laughs> Prin, thank you for the prime sub. Father Bolt, thank you for the bits. Um, yes! Oh my god, that was me! Okay, there was a time, yes, I had a- I was in a Zoom call with like a person, like, I don't know, some- I forget what it was for. Like some meeting with like some guy I hadn't met before. Um, I was in a Zoom call, and then all of a sudden, it- the call was like supposed to be from like 1 to 2. Um, and, um, we were- it was like- 150. So there was still like 10 minutes after the call, right? We're talking. All of a sudden, Zoom call drops. He leaves the call. No context. It just ends. And I was like... <laughs> um, and, and then he like, I was, I was like, do I have to wait? Like, is he gonna come back? Like, what happened? What do I do? It only has like 10 minutes left. We were kind of wrapping up anyway. Like, what do I do? So I waited for a couple minutes and then I just hung up because I was like, this is probably, it's fine, it's over. But his laptop had died, right? And no, you know what else? It wasn't, it was like from 3 to 4 p.m. So I was supposed to go live right at 4. So like, hit the call drops. I had to go live in like five minutes. And I was like, I don't know, what do I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> so I just sat there like, I don't know what, um, do I stay? Do I leave? Do I, I don't know. <laughs> um, and it was so awkward. And then I went live like seconds after. And I was like, you won't believe what just happened to me. <laughs> I was just in this meeting and it ended. <laughs> Anyway, um, it was, it was fine. It, like, didn't matter that much. It just made me really nervous. <laughs> like, what, what was I supposed to do? Um, but it ended up being fine, so. <laughs> well, yeah, like, sent an email possibly, but I, it, like, in the, in the moments trip, it was like, is he gonna come right back? Or is he just gone? Like, so sure, you'd be like, hey, are you fine? Like, what happened? You know, but like, the second it happens, it's like, you're gone now. How long do I wait here for you to come back? Like, <laughs> it's one thing if you would like, for to like send an email and be like, hey, like, are we good? But like, um, cause he did follow up an email like, hey, sorry, my laptop died. But like in those immediate moments, like there's not, the, the email isn't fast enough. And it's like a random guy, my first time talking to him. Anyway, <laughs> it was fine. It just scared me. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go... I think I'm gonna go back to the mines today. I've decided. Well, yeah, like, you have to wait a few minutes to see if he comes back. Um... That's the thing also, like if, if he, so imagine he comes back within like two minutes, but I already emailed him and then he sees the email like two hours later, like that's awkward. So you want to wait a bit before you email, but I, oh, it was so uncomfortable. Luckily he em emailed me and it didn't matter. Like the call was pretty much over anyway, but it scared me. I felt very awkward at the time. <laughs> um, Seth, thank you for the sub gifts. Prin, thank you for the prime sub also. Thank you both so much. Um, anyway, <laughs> anyway, um, my farm is called Bezos and my cat is named Jeff. Yeah, this is the Jeff Bezos farm. We sold our soul to capitalism. We have supported Joja Mart in this save. <laughs> so, um, that's what we're doing today. <laughs> yeah, um, Lance, in this version of the game, um, in the Joja Mart, when you go the Joja Mart route instead of the community center route, um, the Joja Mart, like, the community center, I mean, becomes a Joja Mart warehouse. Um, so it's no longer a community center, it is now just a warehouse full of Joja Mart supplies. 
So, um, hang on. My sister is freaking out texting me. Um, my sister sent me a screenshot of a, a text from her friend. And the text says, Mackenzie Ziegler follows your sister. And now Shanna's freaking out, checking. I didn't know this <laughs> on Instagram. Um, and Shanna's like freaking out, like can't believe it. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> um, that's, um... From Dance Moms, yeah. I was checking. From Dance Moms. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to keep mining. It's funny that Shanna is this excited. Maddie's sister! It's not Ma- Ah! There's two? I don't know much about this. I'm out of the loop. Um, it's Mackenzie, not Maddie. <laughs> okay, anyway, my sister is very excited about this news. <laughs> um, that's kind of fun. They're both on Dance Moms. I see, I never watched Dance Moms. I'm out of the loop. I am so sorry. Um, okay. The luau has begun at the beach. Oops, <laughs> wait. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, let me just kill. Oh yeah. Um, you heard Dan's mom? Oh yeah, well Dan's mom is named Becky. That's different than Dan's mom's. Yeah, Dan's mom and, and Dan's mom's different. Dan's mom is Becky. <laughs> and she's not on TV. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go back and get my cauliflower. I need to run, because I didn't think this through. Whoops. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, my character's hair is blue because I support Joja Mart. How long did you go to college? <laughs> Lana, I graduated in three years. Um, I graduated kind of early, if that's what you mean. I was in university for three years. Typically in the US, degrees take four. I know in a lot of other places it's three, but... Um, anyway. <laughs> Jen, thank you for the bits. Amy, thank you for the six months. Thank you so much, everybody. All right, let me buy or get my golden cauliflower and I will go. My sister is freaking out. Shanna's so excited. <laughs> She's like, she has 15 million followers. <laughs> is there an age gap with me and Dan? Aqueduct? Yeah, a massive one. He's um, two years older than me. He's 23 and I'm 21. <laughs> Massive age gap, yeah. Okay, let me put this away. I added a golden cauliflower to the soup. All right. All right. Um, I'm just talking to everyone really fast. <laughs> Just so that people will like me better. I don't have purple shorts yet, Anne. I'm gonna put the purple shorts in the- This was always the plan. I'm pretty sure if I put the purple shorts in this, they disappear. So I'm gonna put purple shorts in the Grange display in the fall. Um, because I don't have them yet. Um, and then I can use them again next year in year two in the Luau. Um, because then I can do both cutscenes. See? Wait, Maggie, I didn't realize you were that close in age. He's two years or two days younger than you. Um, oh, you get them back? Well, and I didn't know that, but I was worried about it, and I also don't have them yet, so. <laughs> um, I mean, thank you for the two months. Thank you so much. Yeah, I haven't I haven't done it before ever. Um, and again, I, like, don't have them yet, so. I was worried they would disappear, so I didn't, I wasn't gonna put them in here first. Um, all right, let's begin. 
No, Jen, there's no, there's no, um, DLC for Stardew Valley. You don't need to buy any expansions or anything, ever. No expansions, none of that, don't worry. What do you, what do you think about my soup? Let me know. I worked really hard on it. Yes! <laughs> Everyone loves me! The best soup you've ever had. Robin, I got a history degree. I studied history in, in university. Look at him. He's eating all my soup. Did I find someone with the new plaque? Um, Michaela, my new plaque for now is right there. I don't know where to put it yet, so I just put it behind me so that you can see it. <laughs> Laura, thank you for the five months. It's your birthday. Happy birthday. <sighs> The soup was out of this world. I'm very curious to see how much relationship boost I got from that. That's pretty good. I have lots of hearts now. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. I will take it. Um, I might go chop some things down while we wait. Just because we want to waste our energy, you know? <laughs> My face cam for now is just be the reflection of the play button. Like my, yeah, that's a good idea. Just like film my face in the play button and like, that's it. Oops. Okay, my inventory is full. <laughs> right, thank you for the eight month resub. Thank you so much. All right, well. <laughs> Hey, little Dika, it's good to see you. Um, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I might use... Oh, I, I can give that to the museum, actually. Now that I think about it. Alright. Let's go chop some things down. No, I still don't have my TikTok back, Maddie. But today, TikTok replied to my tweet saying, please help me. Um, and they said, thanks for your patience with us while we investigate. Rest assured your concerns have been escalated and a member of our team will follow up as soon as possible to assist. So I finally heard back something from TikTok about my um, unfair ban. So, <laughs> um, finally, some news. Hopefully they'll unban me. Um, Panto, when they say they escalated the request, that means they like told someone like higher up and or the person who has the right ability to look at it. So like when they escalated, it's like, hey, we're gonna bring this up to the people who need it, you know? That's what they mean by that. Um. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna chop some of my trees. Okay, it starts at uh, 6 p.m. Eastern time. So in exactly two hours. So we're, we're not there yet. <laughs> oh wait, do I have two hearts with Marnie yet? Yes, I can get my shorts then. Okay, good. <laughs> I mean, Lewis is shorts, but. Nice, Celeste, since 2017? I respect that. Yeah, no worries, Pinto. It is confusing, especially, like, you know, you speak a different language, so. Weird word to use, though, escalate, in that, but, you know. <laughs> um, yes, I'm live a little bit early, so we can still do a three-hour stream before the thingy starts. I'm really nervous about it. I'm like, I'm getting really anxious about this stream. I know I already did it, so I don't need to do anything tonight, but I'm getting like really nervous for you all to see it. <laughs> I'm really scared that it, I didn't do a good job. You know what I mean? Like, I'm really, I'm really nervous about it. <laughs> I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's fine. I just, the more I, like the closer it gets, the more I'm like, oh no, what if it's, what if I didn't do it right? What if it's bad? <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I just, you know, it's one of those things that it's like you did this thing and you're scared people to see it, so. Um, I'm going to make it into my house in time. Don't worry. Hello, cat. Time for bed. Everything is fine. <laughs> yeah, it's that, like, anticipation, right? It's very scary. <laughs> Paint Moon Dust, thank you for the nine months. Naomi, thank you for the nine months. Brooke, thank you for the nine months. Wait, three nine month subs in a row? And Bears and Butts with the nine months? Four nine month subs in a row? 
Thank you so much, everybody. <laughs> no, um, you know, so the their stream is on Nickelodeon, like on on the Nickelodeon Twitch channel. Um, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna show it here, but I am gonna raid them. So if you stay at the stream, like, um, we'll we'll bring you there. So you'll get to you'll get to see the stream. Don't worry. I'll I will take you to it. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna- I'm gonna raid Nickelodeon, um, before there's- th the stream starts, so that you can watch it. Kirsty, thank you for the seven months. Thank you so much. <laughs> I had to become- because Nickelodeon has, like, I guess they have their channel set, so you have to be friends with them to raid them. Um, so I had to become friends with them on Twitch to raid them, so now I'm friends with Nickelodeon. I don't mean to brag, but- <laughs> I am Twitch friends with Nickelodeon. <laughs> yeah, I know I've watered my coffee. I can't be bothered to do it. I don't really want it. <laughs> Alright, back to killing slimes we go. I am excited to see how many slimes we have killed. I'm gonna go at 2pm. I'm gonna check in the thingy. Okay. Okay. Let me get all of this. Coco, thank you for the two gifted subs. Thank you so much. Can we still spam Eggamounts or do we have to act normal? Well, probably don't spam too much. They might have like follower only mode on. I'm not really sure. Um, I guess we'll see. But probably don't spam. I don't want you to get in trouble in their chat. <laughs> You know, like, that would not be good. We don't want you to get, like, timed out by Nickelodeon. But you might need to follow- I don't know if they have follower-only mode on. So if you want to type in chat, you might be better off following them now. So that you can type in chat later. On the- during the stream. Right? I'm sure they don't have a long follower mode on. But that's- that's not gonna hurt to follow them now. If you're, like, planning on following them to type in chat, you might as well do it now. You know? Yeah, be somewhat normal. <laughs> Only one egg per person. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> Just send one egg, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, there's nothing on for YouTube with Nickelodeon. It was just the Twitch streams that we recorded. Um, or the, just the Twitch sponsor stuff with Nickelodeon that I did. Nothing for YouTube. Um, I also posted today... Um, my first ever sponsored Instagram story. I've never done a sponsored Instagram story before. I've had sponsored tweets, because a lot of times when people, when I do sponsored streams, I say I've only done like a couple. <laughs> but in the past, when I've done sponsored streams, they have like a sponsored tweet with it, you know? Um, but I've never, so I've done that. Um, but the tweet, like, the tweet isn't the only part of the sponsor. It's like a stream, so I also announced the stream on Twitter, you know? Um, but I, I did my first ever sponsored Instagram story today because, um, of the Nickelodeon thing. So, that's kind of fun. I've gotten offers for sponsored Instagram stories before, but a lot of times it's for things that I would, like, never do. Like, a lot of the emails I get for Instagram sponsors, it's, like, hair care brands and, like, a... I don't know, like a hair straightener or like diet pills and like, God, I'm never going to do a diet pill ad. Oh my God. You know. Um, and like, I, it would be so weird if I was like, look at this straightener I got. Like, I just, I don't do like beauty stuff. Like it would be so out of, nor out of the ordinary if I posted like a, a beauty sponsor, you know, on Instagram. So like, I would never take those. Um, that's mostly the kind of emails I get about Instagram sponsors is like things that I would never do, you know? Um, especially not the random, like, vitamins and, like, vitamins and stuff that they sell. Won't catch me doing one of those. <laughs> you have a function of beauty ad. Yeah, imagine. Like, I swear, like, every YouTuber I watch has done a function of beauty sponsor at some point. That's that, um, the, what, it's, what's the word? Shampoo? That's what I'm talking about. You know the function of beauty shampoo where you can like take a quiz and get your custom shampoo. Um, I, I swear like every YouTuber I watch has done one of those at some point. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> All right. Nothing wrong with that. I, I don't know. I, it's fine. I just, I see a lot of ads for them. Never tried it though. 
Do you use it? Is it good, Tiger Lily? I mean, if you use it, <laughs> let us know. Do you know who else does a lot of um, sponsorship type stuff is Cash App. I've never been sponsored by Cash App. They've gifted me subs before, <laughs> but I never actually got sponsored. They just came into my chat and gifted me subs, which is an interesting market marketing tactic, but um, I'll take the subs. <laughs> I've never used Cash App either, but um, Cash App sponsors people on Twitch sometimes, I've seen. They have like a code where you can get $10 for free on Cash App with the code Twitch TV when you make your account. Um, yeah, they gave me bells one time in Animal Crossing. Cash App was like, can we come, can you come to our island or something? Or like, can we come to your island? And I was like, I mean, yeah. <laughs> and then Cash App came to my Animal Crossing island and they gave me a million bells. Which I'll take. <laughs> it's kind of weird how they do stuff like that. They kind of like, I don't know. It's almost like a free sponsor just by like inviting themselves to your to your island. I mean, I don't care, but like, it does it does feel kind of weird to me because it like looks like I'm endorsing Cash App when they do these things, even though I've never even used Cash App. Like, I don't, <laughs> I don't have any um. I don't know, I don't have any experience with it. Like, I, I, this is not a formal Cash App endorsement. I'm sure it's good, but I just have never. Cash App's kind of like Venmo, isn't it? Um, I I have a like Venmo, I don't use it anymore. I don't even have the app on my phone, but like when I was at, like living on campus, people would like Venmo each other to pay back for things. So I had Venmo, I, I never had Cash App though. Um. Your mom got hacked on Cash App? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Did she get any money back? My friend's PayPal got hacked recently, and the person, ooh, Monster Slayer goal complete. The person um, sent themselves all of, they, they like emptied her entire bank account. They took all of her money. Like, they did, like, transfers from her PayPal into their bank account. And they did it in a bunch of small transfers, so a lot of them went through. Um, so she managed to get, like, I, I think they took like $400 from her and she managed to get like 200 of it back, but it's, it was bad. Um, they, and then she still hasn't gotten all the money back from PayPal. But some, like, be very careful about your PayPal because um, you don't want that to happen. <laughs> that is not good. And cause like some of them, like they can stop it if it hasn't gone through yet, because some of them had gone through, they were like giving her a hard time about getting the money back, which is not good. Um, but yeah, that was really scary when that happened. <laughs> so be careful about your PayPal passwords. Um, if I were you, you know, obviously any password is important to be careful with, but especially like passwords to things that have all your money in them, <laughs> like access to your bank accounts and stuff, be very careful with. Um, same thing with like Venmo and, and stuff like that. Um, do not uh, take these things lightly. <laughs> okay, let me... I'm gonna go- oh, let me kill this stuff really fast. Um. <laughs> okay. Ooh, a frog! I mean a crab! <laughs> oh, a frog! <laughs> I meant it's a crab! I'm sorry. Oh, that's really cute, Kenny. That's exciting. Ashley, thank you for the eight months. Timo, thank you for the prime sub. Love for all peoples. Thank you for the bits. Nancy with the bits. Lemons. Shan, um, thank you. I'm so sorry. I like missed all of these. Shan, I didn't get slimed. No, for the Nickelodeon thing. I wish I had, but I did not. Maybe in the future, if they have a real Kids Choice Awards, I'll get invited in person. <laughs> I don't think they'd invite me to the real Kids Choice Awards. I mean, I guess maybe they would, but. 174 of a thousand slimes. We kill all the cave insects we needed to. Um, almost all the duggies. What do you have for me? This dumb thing that I don't want. Great. <laughs> yes, Abigail loves amethyst. Um, good gift for a, a couple of the villagers. A lot of them like amethyst. Um. It's a somewhat new save, Isabel. Yeah, we started this save on Saturday last week. We played for 12 hours on Saturday. 
Um, and now, um, this is our second stream playing it, so. Happy birthday, Honey Monster! I hope you're having a good day. Uh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, cry, I'm actually not zoomed out at all. I have, um, my monitor is, like, probably a higher resolution than yours is, and that's why it looks like this. So I'm, in fact, I'm actually zoomed in a little bit. Um, but this is what, by default, my monitor looks like, because my monitor is bigger. If I was playing on a smaller monitor, the resolution would be different, and it would be bigger. Like, the UI would be bigger. Um, but I have it up a little bit, because it is really small on the screen for all of you. <laughs> um... Yeah, that's because of my monitor. Um, I'm I'm glad, Harley. I like my birthday song, too. <laughs> I am glad that you also like it. Okay, this is the chest where I've been putting things that I need. I still need that. Um, hey, Techni, what's up? All right, let me sell this stuff. Part of me kind of feels like I should go back. <laughs> To the mines again. I'm just trying to make as much progress killing- well maybe actually- no, it's a Friday. Maybe I'll go to the bar and give people presents. Let me see what we've got that people will like. Everybody like- or not everybody, but a lot of people like Amethyst. Do I have a frozen tear? Maybe I'll find Sebastian. I don't know. We'll figure that out. This is a good chance to give gifts to people, right? Uh, Maul, we're doing a charity stream in a couple weeks. Um, not this weekend, but next weekend. Um, so not tomorrow, but like, next. I'm not sure about Friday or Saturday yet. I need to figure out what day works best. Um, I have a lot going on in the next couple of weeks. But I will let you know, probably this weekend I'll figure it out, and then we'll do it. We're doing a charity stream for Able Gamers again. Um, I don't know if you knew this, but there's a, a person called Steven Spawn. He's a streamer as well. Um, and he has a goal to raise a million dollars for Able Gamers um, before his birthday this year. Um, and so there's like a big push. His birthday's in a few months, but there's like a big push next week to raise more money for Able Gamers. And we are doing that too. Able Gamers is a charity, if you didn't know, um, they work to provide access to like customized gaming equipment to people who need it with disabilities. Um, like really cool stuff. Sometimes like like controllers that track your eye movements if you can't use your hands to use the controller. Um, lots of things like that. They provide those kinds of things free of charge to people who need them so that they can play games too. Um, and it's really, really cool. They do a lot of great work. We've done a charity stream, we did a charity stream for them like a few months ago. Um, we raised like $30,000 that day for Able Gamers, um, and we're gonna do another one next week. So that is the plan. If you want to follow Steven, there's a link in the chat as well to his Twitch channel. Really, really cool person. I, I think you'll like his his content a lot. Um, and he's just all around a really good guy. So, <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna give some gifts to people while we're in here. I might. Can I even give a gift to a lot of these people? Like, I can give one more to Emily. I can't give more to Shane. I can to Abigail. No way, Riley, really, that's really, really lucky. Um, that's exciting. Okay. Sorry, we're trying to romance everybody, so... <laughs> Don't mind me! Um... <laughs> it's like, I'm planning on, on dating everyone all at once. I want to date literally the entire game. All at once. Um, that is our plan. <laughs> so... <laughs> Who will I romance in this save? Uh, everyone. We will romance everyone. Um, I, I plan on cheating on them all. <laughs> There's a cutscene that happens when they find out that you have been dating them all behind their backs, you know? Um, and I've never seen it before. So that's what we're trying to do, is trying to get to that cutscene and see it. Um, I haven't given many gifts to Harvey or Alex. Can't really get to them very, as easily though. Okay. Um, can I even give a gift to Alex? Sebastian got both. I guess I might as well give something to Lewis while I'm here. I haven't really done a very good job of befriending Lewis. I'm not that concerned about Lewis though. Like, <laughs> we can't date him, so <laughs> it's not really my problem. Um, 
Are you comfortable sharing how tall you are? My guess is six foot eight. Yeah, I'm actually six foot nine suit. So, Sophia, thank you for the two months. Matilda, thank you for the two months. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually six foot nine. Um, yeah, true story. Not a lie. <laughs> nice work, chat. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> okay. One second. I don't, I was just trying to ask my mods a question and I really, the, I, I really fell apart in the last half. Anyway, I, there was a lot of typos in that one. <laughs> one second. Okay. Um. No, I did not get unbanned from TikTok yet, Tyler. It's a sore subject. I don't want to watch a cutscene right now. I'm actually five foot five, by the way. I'm not actually six foot eight, although it would be fun if I was. Okay, I can't give Alex more gifts this week. Um, oh, Scam, that is that is really, really wonderful news. Congratulations. I'm very glad to hear that. Um, that is that is awesome news. Um, Tommy got banned again. Did Tommy Innit get banned again? See, it keeps happening to people. Why? <laughs> Um, yes, but this tomorrow I know. Don't worry, Julie. I've got a gift for him. Um, I have a gift for, for Alex. I have, a some food for him. A salmon dinner that we think he will love. So, I'm just gonna go to bed. Okay. Level 6 combat? Nice. Oh, we're not making much money right now. Oh, I meant to make- oh, I forgot to start it last night. I was going to- I was thinking I would make some more pickles so I can give Harvey another gift. <laughs> and then I forgot to! Dang it! Are these ready? Perfect. Oh, we're gonna be rich. Okay, easy. Easy! Okay, so we have, what, three- there's, some um, twelve sprinklers that all need to get more melons. But I think I have nine melon seeds already. So. Okay, oh, that's a good good, good uh, catch space. It sounds like Nickelodeon has a 10 minute follower only mode chat. So if you wanna type in Nickelodeon's chat later when we raid them, um, you might wanna follow them now if you're gonna be here later. Um. Okay. Um, I'm gonna save like 10 of those maybe, and then we'll sell, oh, I might, actually, I might save a couple gold ones too, just in case. And then I'm just gonna sell the rest of them. <laughs> For money. Oh, I got the red plate recipe from Emily. I'm going to turn these into, oh, I probably should have, actually, I probably should have brought those to Pierre's to sell to Pierre. Um, I don't have any kegs yet. I haven't made any. Do I even have the recipe for kegs yet? I don't think I have a high enough farming skill to get kegs yet. Um, so alas, I, I do not put them in kegs. <laughs> um, eventually we will, but I don't have the recipe yet, so I do not. Okay, um, yes, Maggie, thank you for the link in chat. I really appreciate that. Um, I'm going to... We need to buy a bunch of seeds. 12 sets of eight, okay. And we already have nine. And I'm just gonna go sell the rest of these peppers. Um, Stardew is a farming game, Infinity. It's like a farming simulator. Um, oh. No, I don't have a coop yet. <laughs> I, yeah, we need 87 seeds, I know. Um, I don't have a coop yet. We don't have enough money <laughs> to buy a coop. We will sell we sold our first um, melons, so we'll get a coop hopefully tomorrow um, But alas, we do not have a coop yet. What am, why did I come here this early? I also didn't even bring the present for Alex Yeah, this is my progress of who I'm dating so far I'm not actually dating anyone yet, but <laughs> this is my progress so far um, 
I've got quite a few hearts with, with some people. Like, I've got seven hearts with Emily. So we're gonna date Emily first, it looks like. Um, which is good. Um, yeah, Emily, Tommy Unit has been banned on TikTok, much like me. Um, it sounds like a couple times. <laughs> so, um, I got banned on TikTok for no reason. He got banned on TikTok for no reason. Um, <laughs> let me get one second. Um, okay. Um, yes, I'm still banned, Sarah. Um, not unbanned yet. Okay. Um, What did I come here for? Oh, the dinner for Alex. <laughs> That's right. I wanted to get my salmon dinner to give to Alex for his birthday. It is Alex's birthday, right? Yes, it's the 13th. Okay. Yes. Um, Hazel, I'm going to get off at 6, actually, an hour earlier than usual, because um, today I am going to be on Nickelodeon's Twitch channel <laughs> at 6. Um, so we're going to get off a little bit early. So, And just for the record, chat, um, the Nickelodeon stream is pre-recorded, so I I'm not, like, ignoring you. <laughs> if you watch the Nickelodeon stream, I'm not like ignoring you if I don't answer your questions in chat. I'm simply not there. <laughs> it's pre-recorded. I know you probably knew that, but just in case you- ah, I don't have enough money! Oh no. Oh no, I need to go- oh no. Oh no. Um, that's at six though. For the Kids' Choice Awards, um, Orange Carpet. <laughs> Am I gonna watch it? I don't know. I don't want to listen to myself. I'm too nervous. <laughs> I'll definitely leave it open. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna watch it though. <laughs> no, we're fine. I've got 27 silver melons we can sell to him. Don't worry. Don't worry. Um, but <laughs> anyway, I don't wanna, I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> I definitely want to watch it though because I want to see what they did with it because I know they edited it a little bit um, But maybe I'll just mute it <laughs> Maybe I'll watch with it muted <laughs> Okay um. I was trying to put them into one stack. And I... <sighs> okay. Abby, <laughs> thank you for the bits. Father Bold, thank you for the bits. Yes, I, I did complete 100% in my other save. Um, we 100 percented my last save, so that's why we started this one. Um, Healy, Sarah, thank you both for the bits. Wait, Healy, um, I'm so glad that you've got more ancient fruit seeds than the crow, because the crow ate your last one. I'm glad that you got a new one. Um, I am genuinely very glad for you that you managed to get into more ancient fruit seeds for your greenhouse because the crow ate your last one because I really did feel bad for you with that. Um, thank you all so much. Also, again, Sarah, thank you for the bits and congrats on your first week of in-person teaching. Oh my god, cat. Do you see? <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Oh my goodness. Very embarrassing. Anyway, so the reason I just restarted the day is because I was trying to put the seeds into a stack, but then I sold them by accident. <laughs> and um, I would have lost a lot of money doing that. Um, so, uh, my bad. <laughs> but we started the day over. We didn't get very much progress, so it's fine. Um, what am I going to play tomorrow? Boss, I'm probably going to play The Sims tomorrow. My cat is, like, rubbing her face into the YouTube play button box. Hey, Snap. Can I help you? Do you want up? Come here. <laughs> Log, thank you for the five months. Um, also, Abby, thanks again for the 17 months. Um, I really appreciate you. Come here, Snappy. Do you want to say hi to everybody? Come here. Here's my cat, everyone. Um, this is my best friend. She's here to say hi to everybody. Right? Oh my gosh, the cutest thing has been happening recently. So, I- Snap has two beds in this room. I know, I have too many cat things, but Snap has two beds in this room, and one of them I usually keep on the- 
little like futon couch thingy right there, right? Um, but the other day I was vacuuming. So I like took it off and then I put it underneath the couch so that I could vacuum better. Um, so it was like out of the way so I could vacuum the room, you know? Um, let me see if I can find the picture. <laughs> Um, because I sent it, I, I was taking pictures of her, but she went, she climbed into it and was laying in it when it was underneath the couch and she was like needing it. Like, you know, like cats need like blankets and stuff. She was just laying there like needing the, the cat bed underneath the couch. It was really funny. I, mean, I have pictures. Hang on. I'm just scrolling through me and Dan's DMs. I have to scroll very far to last night, but don't mind me. Okay. Wait, look at this. <laughs> It's so funny. Look at she was just laying there. And you can see her paws are out of stretch because she was like needing it. <laughs> but she loved it down there. So I think I might keep it. It's not as like close to the top of her head as it looks. There's like more space under there than it looks like. Um But she was just laying there. <laughs> Look. <laughs> she just went. She was just hanging out. I just, I think this is so funny. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Why did she go under there? But she loved it. She was having a great time. So I guess I'll keep it. I mean, I, it makes sense that she would like it under there because it's like, you know, cats like to feel like they're in a safe little space and they're like, you know, she's protected on many sides. So it makes sense she would like it, but it's really cute. Um, so anyway, <laughs> here is my cat. It's like a little cat cave. Yeah, exactly. Um, Colleen, thank you for the 15 months, by the way. Lil Deb, thank you for the bits. Thank you guys so much. I just, I love my cat. I really, really love my cat. <laughs> it does look, it's like a fort. You know how we like to make forts? She likes to hang out in her little cat cave. I'm gonna make a few more fertilizers, I think. I should save a lot of this sap for the fall, though, to put on my cranberries. Um, but for now, I have a few more. <laughs> okay, and we can actually go back and, and buy the proper amount of seeds this time. I'm gonna save, like, what did I say? Three of those and ten of these? Yeah. That will do. <laughs> Let me grab this. Okay. Okay. Yes, my one million subscriber plaque is right there. <laughs> I didn't know what to do with it, so I just put it there. Sorry, sap- okay, so what I- what I meant by that is you turn the sap into fertilizer and then you put the fertilizer on my cranberry seeds to make more money. That's what I was talking about, in case that wasn't clear. <laughs> um, Pathetic Honey, thank you for the bits. Thank you so much. Alright. Let's get my gift again. Do I have anything for Harvey? I guess? I don't know. Um, pickles, coffee. Uh, maybe I'll buy him some coffee and go give it to him today. Oh, I don't know. When you have so many awards, you have to put them on the floor. I mean, yeah. <laughs> when you say it like that, it sounds bad. Um, I want to give Harvey a loved gift, Sparks. I don't have any pickles. I know he loves pickles, but I don't have any right now. So we'll have to wait until we can give him some pickles, but... Yes, it's Alex's birthday. That's why I'm gonna give Alex, uh, this salmon dinner. I brought that for him. On purpose. I'm ready. <laughs> yeah, just get a second house to hold all my awards. Right, right, of course. Ooh. There are a lot of things down here. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Yeah, Pierre is married to Caroline Guppy, um, and their daughter is Abigail. Harvey is not Pierre, um, and Harvey is single. <laughs> um, yeah, Bean, I've had my plaque for More Simsy for a while. That's the More Simsy plaque, that's my million subscriber plaque, and that's the Lil Simsy, this one. It's different, because it's old. That's the Lil Simsy 100k plaque. Um... But yeah, Harvey works in the hospital. Harvey is the doctor. Pierre um, is the one who works in the grocery store. 
Steph, I'm gonna hang them up somewhere, but I don't know where to put them yet. Because I don't really have a place to put them in this room. So I need to figure it out still. I don't really know where I'm gonna put it. <laughs> that guy standing on the beach, um, he only comes when it's raining. Um, he sells- I can't buy it from him yet, but he sells, um, mermaid pendants. It's like basically like the equivalent of an engagement ring in Stardew Valley. Um, so if I was dating someone, I could buy a mermaid pendant from him and then propose to my partner, but I am not dating anyone, so I cannot. <laughs> um, that's how that works. Okay. You meant to harvest your spice berries and instead destroyed your melons. Oh no, blueberry. Restart the day. Start over. <laughs> okay. Um, that's true, Becca. I could put them, like, in the living room. But I want to have them in my office, because I spend the most time in here, you know? So I want to have my plaques in here, but I'm not really sure what to do. Okay. Let's sell... Oh my goodness, lots of money. Okay, um, let's buy 87 melons. Lots of melons. And then, um, I think... Do you know what? We could pay off the minecarts at Joja Mart today. Here you go, Alex. I love you. He loves me! <laughs> yeah, we could we could buy the minecarts from Jojo Mart today. Ooh, cutscene. Razor, thank you for the four months. I don't have a coop still, but eh. <laughs> eh. Uh, Razor, thanks for the four months, Fox. Thank you for the two months. Perfect shapes. Thank you for the six months. Kayla, thank you for the two months. Thank you all so much. You were all very kind. Thank you. Sammy, I don't I I think a lot of people's sub badges aren't showing up right now. I think a lot of things are kind of glitching right now for some reason. I don't know why. Um. Oh. I wasn't reading. What did it, what did I just say? Oh, I embarrassed him, didn't I? Oh no. Uh oh. Have you ever wondered why I live with my grandparents? You see, my father wasn't a good guy. He ruined everything for me and my mom. I'm so sorry, Alex half the time he was gone, the other half he'd drink all night and tell me I'm worthless and that I'd never amount to anything. Uh, see, so many people think this game is just like a, a little farm game. It's not just a little farm game. <laughs> um, a lot of the characters have like really deep backstories. <laughs> it's very emotional. Um, I think he resented me for being young. Bitter because he'd wasted his youth doing nothing and had gotten nowhere in life. Do you see what I mean? Alex, do you need a hug? I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> um, one day he left and soon after that mom got sick and passed away. I had no choice but to move, my, move in with my grandparents. I like Alex. I know a lot of people don't like Alex because he's kind of like mean when you, when you first meet him. Um... You seem like someone I can trust. <laughs> As I'm about to cheat on him with everyone in the whole town. He says, you seem like someone I can trust. <laughs> I'm gonna date like 10 people all at once. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> if there's one good thing about my past, it's that it made me strong. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Ew! He's giving the dog steak. That's fun. Well, that's gonna come in handy. Oh, no. Oh, you're strong, Alex? That's good. Because <laughs> I'm going to cheat on you. <laughs> With everyone. <laughs> Pay for the quarry first? Taz, I don't want the quarry. I was planning on paying for the quarry last. Why would I pay for the quarry first? I want the minecarts. I don't really care about the quarry. Um, the minecarts are- I can't even get the quarry, it's 25,000. Um, minecarts 15,000, greenhouse 35,000, panning is kind of useless. I think I'll get panning last. I want to get the minecarts and the bus and then the greenhouse before winter. 
Um, I'm getting the minecarts. I've done it. So they'll be open tomorrow. Nice. Emma, thank you for the six months. This is big. Now we can get around faster. Nice. I'm actually pretty excited about this. <laughs> My life's gonna be so much easier starting tomorrow. This is a big day. But yeah, I think we should be able to afford the bus next. And then I'll get the greenhouse before the winter time. And then we should be set. And then we can worry about the rest of it. I think that the Jojo Mart route is like technically easier than doing the community center. Um, and you can definitely do it way faster. Like you could unlock everything way faster than the community center. Cause with community center stuff, like you can't, some of it you can't even do until year two. Like if you don't get the, the thingy, the red cabbage. Um, whereas with the Jojo Mart route, like you can make a lot of money and pay it off really fast. Like it's not hard, <laughs> you know? Um, but this is my first time doing it. So I guess I'll give you some final thoughts once we've actually finished it, but. From what I'm seeing, I, I think this will be easier, but I much prefer doing the community center. It's like more fun to do the community center, you know? Um, but this is my first time playing this way. So I, it's kind of fun playing this way too, just cause it's like a, a new thing, you know? It's a new experience for me. So I'm enjoying it. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to the, the mines today. Um, it's your birthday, Sky Simmer, happy birthday. <laughs> also, goose to plant quickly. I'm not pressing any specific buttons, but if you didn't know, if you hold your mouse like far away from, like if you want to plant like here, hold your mouse far away, right click to keep planting and then just walk. It'll plant everything where, where you're clicking um, or where you're walking. But so basically to do that, because usually if you hold your mouse here, it plants like each place you click, you know? Um, but if you click far away and just hold right click and walk, it plants wherever you walk. I learned that, um, from Tushi, and I'm very glad I did because it's very easy. <laughs> okay. Hello, Abigail. You're so good at this. You're doing so well. I'm so proud of you. Okay. Yeah, Amanda, I did put the pepper in the preserves jar, so we'll have pickles for Harvey. Um, I'm just, um, enjoying the weather. <laughs> yeah, I guess you would be one to appreciate this somber ambiance. I mean, yeah. But what the heck? <laughs> I came here to spend time alone. Oh. Yeah, peppers make, um, uh, wait, Hopper makes jelly? The pepper makes jelly instead of pickles? Dang it! <laughs> oh well. I'll give Harvey um, some coffee then, I guess. <laughs> Dang, I guess that makes sense, but... <sighs> well... Because the peppers are technically a fruit, yeah. Usually vegetables make pickles and pepper or, and fruit makes jelly. In your mind, you think of peppers as a vegetable, much like tomatoes, but you're not gonna pickle a tomato, are you? No. Oh well. Kate, thank you for the sub gift. Wait, carry on Kate with the sub gift to carry on Guppy. Thank you for, you haven't had pickle? Maggie. Maggie, you should try pickles. I think you'll like them. Pickles are good. Um, yeah, Maggie hasn't tried a lot of things. Um. But Maggie, I think you would like pickles. It's, they're like, salty and crunchy. And they're good. It's good. Pickles look and smell gross. They look a bit weird, yeah. But that, I mean, that's okay. <laughs> Where would Harvey be out? It's summer in the rain. He'll oh, he'll go to the Star Drop Saloon at 5 30. Okay, well, I'll catch him in the saloon tonight then. Um, that'll be good. So I'll just go into the mines for a couple hours and we'll catch Harvey the saloon and I'll buy him a coffee. Ooh. There are sweet pickles, that's true, but I don't like those. 
Anyway, I always liked pickles. You know what's kind of fun? Fried pickles. And if it makes you feel better, pickles are literally just cucumber, but pickled. So it's... Maybe this is worse. I was gonna say it's like a salty cucumber <laughs> uh, that tastes a bit like vinegar. But I feel like that is not a good way to describe them to a picky person. <laughs> you know? But I feel like cucumber is a really um, bland vegetable. Do picky people like do picky, do picky people like cucumbers? I feel like carrots are like the classic like picky people like carrots. It's like the easiest vegetable is carrots. Do they like cucumber? I like cucumbers, but I I like all I eat a lot of vegetables. I'm picky, but not picky with vegetables. <laughs> TJ, thank you for the two months. Thank you so much. Okay. Um. So like you know I as a picky person, um, am the wrong person to ask about vegetables, because I- I eat all vegetables. <laughs> oh, I don't like eggplant, though. All vegetables except eggplant. Hate eggplant. Can't deal with that. No, 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 no. That stems from people trying to offer me, like, eggplant parmesan is- ugh. Don't like eggplant. The rest of it's fine, though. And for some reason, I just have a thing about eggplant. I don't know why. <laughs> um... I just can't deal with it. <laughs> I'm sorry if you like eggplants. I like every other vegetable, except eggplants. I should try and cook it myself, because I bet I would like it better if I cooked it myself. I'm just used to people, for, like, you know, eggplant being a, the default vegetarian option for years of my life, and not wanting it, <laughs> so. I like zucchini. Um. I just mm, don't like eggplant. I like celery. Celery is good. I have celery in my house right now. You ever put like peanut butter on celery? It's fun, it's crunchy. And there's peanut butter. I don't put raisins on it though. People call it like ants on a log, don't they? No, not with the raisins. Just with the celery and peanut butter by itself is fine. <laughs> Um, I also like to- ooh! Monster Slayer goal complete. I also like to put peanut butter on apples. That is one of my favorite snacks. Um. What kind of nightmare is peanut butter on celery? It's not bad! It's good! I'm telling you it's good! Celery doesn't taste like anything. So you put peanut butter on it, and it's crunchy and there's like some peanut butter. It's a nice snack! It's a nice snack! I'm telling you, you would like it if you tried it. <laughs> Emily, thank you for the 23 months. <laughs> I'm feeling really judged right now. <laughs> um, Emily, thanks again for the 23 months though. Katie, thank you for the six months. Uh, McReady, thank you for the three months. TG, thank you for the two months. Blueberry, thank you for the bits. And Sea Stone, thank you for the five months. Luna, thank you for the 31 months. Thank you so much. You don't like peanut butter? I mean, that's valid. I like peanut butter a lot. It's one of my favorite snacks. And f my favorite flavor, I should say. I don't just eat peanut butter that often by itself, but... Like, peanut butter ice cream, that's fun. You know, peanut butter on things, that's fun. Like, peanut butter and jelly on toast, that's fun. Um, I'm just- I'm pro-peanut butter. <laughs> peanut butter cookies, yeah. Um... <laughs> Ooh. All right. What, you don't put peanut butter on toast? You never have- what do you put on toast then? If not peanut butter, what do you put on toast? Butter? Just jelly? What do you- like... Peanut butter goes on toast, that's a thing. People do that! <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> don't make me feel weird about this, it's a thing! <laughs> well, I put- I put butter on toast, too, but I like peanut butter on toast. Um... What it I'm confused. Shan- Oh, you were just deleting- okay, I get it now. I saw- I saw someone get banned and I got scared, so I was looking at their message history, but it was nothing. 
<laughs> Never mind. False alarm. Um. Okay. You like peanut butter? This, this is really, honestly, this peanut butter toast thing seems to be really polarizing. Um. <laughs> we, we all have very strong peanut butter on toast opinions. Okay. I'm gonna go to the place. One second. Okay. Sorry. Just talking to my mods. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go buy Harvey the coffee, though, that I was planning on doing. Um. <laughs> My option, my choice, butter, cream cheese, peanut butter, jelly, something else. Well, butter on toast is a classic. I mean, you can't go wrong. That's like definitely the best option. Butter on toast, like bread and butter is just the standard. However, um, I like peanut butter and jelly together on toast. I also would take just jelly, but I'm putting butter as my answer, as my, um, what I put on toast. But like butter on toast, you really just can't go wrong there, you know? Oh, that sounds good, little Zika. I, I respect that. Jalen, thank you for the sub gift. Thank you so much. You said you put butter on your toast before you toast it so it gets crunchy and buttery and then you put Nutella on it on top. Yeah, you really can't go wrong there. <laughs> okay, Harvey, I have some coffee for you. Okay. Um... Blueberry jam all the way. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> I'm just gonna say hi to the singles that are in here really fast. I don't care about the rest of these people, but I, I'm trying to date everyone. So all the singles I'm gonna say hi to. <laughs> well, Minty, I guess it depends what kind of toaster you have. Cause like, I don't have a stand up toaster. I have a toaster oven. So you just like, put the toast in flat so you can put things on top of it and it won't like it's not like you're putting the toast in like this standing up straight it's not gonna like drip down into the toaster you know um but I don't I don't know so like I could put butter on my toast before I toast it I do that sometimes too but um I just find that toaster ovens are more versatile than a pop-up toaster so I have one of those <laughs> um, Helene, thank you for the five months. Sims Freak, thank you for the nine months also. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm gonna put all these things away again. I have a couple things for the museum now that we have to bring eventually. Okay, I might go chop down some trees. <laughs> hmm, Bex, thank you for the bits. Um, put butter and cheese or like orange marmalade on toast. That makes sense to me. Yeah. I don't, um, I've never had like orange jelly before. I was always like a strawberry or raspberry jelly kind of person or grape jelly, like obviously. Um, yeah, toaster ovens are just like mini ovens, exactly. Um, but they toast things nicely as well. It just works out well. <laughs> um, Okay, if I put peanut butter and jelly on toast, I'd make it like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, like peanut butter first and then the jelly on top, you know? Um, I do have an air fryer, Carter. I bought an air fryer a few months ago. Air fryers are basically just mini ovens too. It's just like a mini convection oven, but it cooks things so fast because it's small. You know when you like, you wanna make, I don't know, like French fries in the oven and you gotta like put, cook them for like 20 minutes or something, to make them crispy enough or longer in an air fryer, 10 minutes done and perfect. So easy. Don't turn the whole oven on. Like it's just, it's so much better. <laughs> um, I like my air fryer a lot. I'm really glad that I bought it. And again, it's basically just a mini oven. Like it, it were, it's a convection oven, but like it's so fast. Can you air fry toast? I mean, probably. I don't know. I've not tried that. I mean, yeah. You wouldn't get the, like, toasty lines that you would from a toaster. Because it's not, like, on a rack like that. But, I mean, yeah, probably. 
Um, yeah, like leftover pizza in the air fryer, so good. You toast bagels in the air fryer? Yeah. Lines? I'm talking about my toaster oven. It has like a rack. So you know when you toast, it gets like lines on the bottom. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Leave me alone. Kate, thank you for the bits. Oh, it was your sister. Oh, of course. They got a sub gift. Bex, thank you for the bits again though, a second ago. Um, level seven farming finally. Ooh, level five foraging. Definitely gatherer. Chance for double harvest of foraged items. Absolutely. Um, pancakes. Okay. Lauren, thank you for the prime sub. Okay. <gasps> My first blueberries. Okay. Um, I'm gonna take a screenshot of myself really fast. Just for the VOD. <laughs> I'm just gonna get a picture of myself and my blueberries. <laughs> Whoa, what's a prime sub? A sub for free? Now, Riley, let me tell you. Did you know? Clearly you don't as a person with a prime badge next to your name. <laughs> but did you know that if you have your Amazon Prime account, you can connect it to Twitch and you get a free sub every 30 days? You already pay for Amazon Prime. So if you connect your account, you can get a free sub every 30 days, completely free, included in your Prime subscription. You're already paying for it, technically, because you already pay for Prime. So if you don't use it, you're just wasting your money because it's an included perk. Every 30 days, a free sub. I still get paid, like a cut of it, as if you had sub with money. Um, but it was, uh, you didn't sub with money. You sub for free. Um, so, <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying you should consider it. But that's not not a prank, by the way. You actually get a um, a free sub if you do that, and it's very well worth it. Um, take advantage of of the free sub. Should I just sell this star fruit? Probably. Or no, I should make preserves with it. Right. I'll get more money. Nice prime sub, Sasha. Thanks for the prime sub, Lauren. Thank you for the sub gift and the prime sub. Uh, and best, thank you for the prime sub as well. Thank you so much. But yeah, you get all the perks um, of a regular sub. Like you don't get ads on my stream. You get all the emotes, all that, and you get a free sub every thirty days. Jordan, thank you for the seventeen months. Um, okay. And again, you already pay for Amazon Prime if you have it, so it's well worth it. Completely free. Sid, I haven't seen The Bachelor in years. How, um... Was there, like, some drama this season? Why do I have, like, a vague memory of that trending on Twitter? I'm really out of the loop. I don't know anything about The Bachelor. I guess there's always drama. But... <laughs> I feel like I saw something trending on Twitter, but I don't remember- I don't... really follow The Bachelor, so... Um, this season was super dramatic. Is it over now? Not drama, racism? Oh my god, how bad Okay. <laughs> this show is really, um... Wait, didn't Chris Harris have to step down? Wait, no, I knew that! That's why I saw it trending, because Chris Harrison stepped down, right? Yeah, again, I didn't really follow- I don't- I'm not really following it, so I probably- I'm- I don't really know what happened. Um, but... <laughs> That's not good. Bring Pam a pale ale. I can't do that yet. Bring Leah a gold bar. Oh, I can do that. Do I have one? Yeah. That's really bad. Really, really, really bad. Tyler, thank you for the prime sub. Nova, thank you for the prime sub. Rebecca, thank you for the nine months. Jordan, thank you for the 17 months. Um, Laura, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you so much, everybody. Um, anyway, that's um, very stressful and not good. <laughs> oh my god. Why- this show- how- they've had like a million seasons, haven't they, too? Um, the Twitch Bachelor thing? Okay, Tracy, oh my god. There was some drama with the Twitch Bachelor thing, too. I don't know if you remember, but I told you all we were joking about this, um... I got, like, an email. A really vague, ridiculous email that was like, Hello, is this the email for Lil Simsy? Um, 
And I was like, first of all, this is the most unprofessional way of, like, reaching out to people ever. But, okay. But I, and I saw that their email address was twitchesmosteligible.com. Like, that was the, you know? And I was like, what? So I googled them to find out what it was. I'm scrolling. They've got on their website, it's like, nine beautiful women. One Twitch superstar. And it was like, okay, that's a little... First of all, I was offended by that. <laughs> um, but anyway. And then they, the whole concept, they were going to have, like, fly out a bunch of streamers to some scary mansion in the middle of nowhere, like, at the end of February, to film a, like, six-hour-long bachelor contest. Right? Pandemic? Anyway, so I get the email... And I usually wouldn't reply to this email, but I was, like, kind of curious because of how bizarre it all was. And I was a bit offended by it, so I emailed them back to ask questions. <laughs> because I needed to know, I needed to know. So I emailed them back, and I was like, hey, tell me more, basically, right? They come back, they give me some information. Um, I emailed them, and it sounded like, obviously, it wouldn't be paid. Which, it should be if they're gonna force you to, like, fly out somewhere for days, but whatever. Um, and so I was, like, asking them some questions. Um, and then I replied to the email and I was like, actually, I'm in a relationship, sorry, <laughs> and I won't be going. And then we, I stopped emailing them. But after, like, this happened, a few days later, it came out that they had been, like, emailing every streamer ever. Like, like, so many streamers got these weird, vague emails with the same, the same, like, starting where it was like, hello, is this the correct contact email for you? Like, that was their starting email. And I don't understand, that is the dumbest way to, like, lead off a conversation. Hello, is this your correct email? Just start with the email about the show. Why would you start like that? Like, email the concept and see if they want to reply. Why would you start that way? But whatever. Um, but they had been emailing that same thing to, like, everybody. And everyone thought it was kind of creepy because it was, like, this weird, like, these random people. None of them were streamers. It was, like, some random investor guy and, like, a few other people on the team. Um, like, it was just really bizarre. Um, and honestly, I don't know what they were doing, but something very fishy was happening. And they had, like, they are like, we have a, a six-figure advertising budget. Or maybe they said five-figure. Big difference. But they were like, we have a five-figure advertising budget for this and, like, all this stuff. Where'd you get that money? How are you gonna make money on this? Like, when you launch the Twitch show? Like, no one's gonna pay you to watch it. Like, I don't- like, there's no money in this. Like, when you first start a Twitch channel like this, like, there's no money in it. And I feel like it'd be different if a streamer were trying to host a dating show, kind of like Austin Show's Lover Host. But his is virtual. <laughs> it's, like, over Zoom. Um, and not, like, trying to fly out to a mansion. Um, but, anyway. Well, actually, my email address is on my Twitch channel. Like, my- everybody's email addresses were- like, they weren't just trying to confirm my email. Like, it- that my, my email's just on my channel. It was, it's very dumb. Anyway, very sketchy. Very random. Um, weird vibes from these people. Um, but I don't know. Yeah, like, they would have found my email address on my Twitch channel. Like, they would have scrolled down and seen my business email and been like, oh, is this your business email? Like, yeah. <laughs> it says it right there. Like, <laughs> um, well, Drea, that's what I was getting to. So Austin Show makes money because he's a big Twitch channel and people sub and donate because he's a big channel who already had a big audience that started doing the show. A random person with zero Twitch followers, starting a show isn't gonna make any money, especially in the beginning, and, like, until they build it up more, right? But if they're spending, like, thousands of dollars to fly people out and rent this mansion and have an advertising budget, like, where is the money coming from and how do you intend to make it back? Like, and you can't get, like, advertising, like, you can't get, like, a sponsor because you have zero followers. Like, there's nothing to show for your, I don't know, it's just very bizarre. Like, but they just, they, like, deleted the whole thing. They, like, people started calling him out on Twitter, and then they just deleted it. And then it just stopped. I don't know. It's really weird. <laughs> and that's what I was saying. Like, it would make more sense if, like, an actual streamer with, like, a known name was doing it. Because it's more trustworthy instead of just, like, four random people. You know? Um, because, like... If an actual streamer was doing it, it's like, oh, you're a human. Like, 
you're a person who has an audience, like, I've seen you on Twitch, like, I trust you more than, like, just a random investor. I don't know, very sketchy, weird vibes. <laughs> um, Cindy, thank you for the 30 months, Moody, thank you for the 4 months, BJ, thank you for the bits, AJ with the prime sub, Ambiguous, thank you for the sub, RC with 31 months, Lauren, thank you for the bits, um, thank you all so much, um, and Bonnie, thank you for the prime sub. Okay, anyway, it's just not very credible, basically, is the point that we're trying to make. <laughs> It's just a bit odd, isn't it? Um, but oh well. It made me laugh a lot when I got the email, so. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's part of why people thought it was so sketchy, is that like half the team had fake names listed on the profile. Um, and one of them had a picture on their bio that wasn't of them. So it was like, really weird. <laughs> Well, and Angel, yeah, they were contacting, like, the, the whole premise was that it was going to be nine beautiful women and one Twitch superstar. So they were trying to find, like, nine beautiful women, like, nine female streamers to have on the show. Weird vibes. Weird vibes. <laughs> Happy birthday, Sushi. I'll sing you a song. Goose, thank you for the prime sub also. Uh... <laughs> well, yeah, exactly, Shella. Of course, women can't be a Twitch superstar. I mean, that would be ridiculous. A woman? Superstar? No. On Twitch? No. Certainly not. <laughs> I don't know. I, like, they probably didn't mean anything bad with that, but it made me feel gross. I did not like the wording of that. Um, but anyway. <laughs> Camellia, thank you for the three months. Raquel, thank you for the 10 months. Thank you both so much. Um, okay, I'm going to go kill some more things. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. <laughs> Girls would never get like a Nickelodeon sponsorship or something. I mean, come on. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, it's fine. It's not the worst thing I've heard. Unfortunately, I've heard much worse as a uh, woman in the gaming space. <laughs> it's just one of those things. It's like, come on, nine beautiful women in one Twitch superstar. Like, I guess that's just how bachelor type things are often written too, right? Ooh, an amethyst. I'll take it. But you're the only Twitch superstar there is. No, you're right, Opal. I'm actually the biggest streamer on Twitch. That's a true story. I'm not lying. That's real. I am- I am the biggest Twitch streamer. <laughs> um, oh, well, thanks again for the bits, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The- yeah, the biggest! She's eight feet tall! Exactly! <laughs> I am the biggest Twitch streamer. I'm eight feet tall. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I thought you were 6'9. When will the lies stop? I'm sorry, Shella. I really should stop telling lies on stream. I'm six foot nine, but when I have my heels on, I'm eight feet tall. Could you imagine wearing a like a foot high heel? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> More than. That is a, a very tall heel. I like it though. I look really good in it. I, I don't really wear heels. Um, I have very little experience in heels. Um, to be truthful with you. Those are called stilts, yeah. <laughs> 13 inch heels, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, so many of these. I don't even need to kill them anymore. I already killed all the ones I needed to. Um. Okay. Okay. I'm just killing more bugs in case you couldn't tell. I'm also here to kill slimes. Anyway. Um, I don't have a lot of experience wearing heels, so I'm not, I don't know. I'm not really a big shoe person. I don't have a ton of shoes. Like, I, <laughs> I have one pair of heels, but not, not big ones. Um, okay. I'm gonna go lower down, I think. 
my favorite Twitch streamer, who is not only the biggest Twitch streamer, but also a mega famous TikToker, Lil Simsy. This is a sore subject. How dare you call me a TikToker? You know I've been banned. <laughs> you know I'm not a TikToker anymore. <laughs> I just like start sobbing. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm fine. I'm not upset. <clears throat> it's okay. Deep breath, chat. We're fine. We're gonna get through this. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, ex TikToker, okay? <laughs> One day, when I get my TikTok back, I'm gonna become a TikToker. Alright, mark my words. Would that be my big drama at the the Bachelor House, the Twitch's most eligible house? <laughs> Is that I got banned on TikTok? I'm like the edgy one who got banned on TikTok. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's so dumb. Please don't hurt me. No, please, please. The edgy one who posted four TikToks ever and got wrongfully banned. Sorry, it's a sore subject. I'm gonna get over it. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, this is summer of year one, Sid. I'm not, um, I'm not very far along in this thing. <laughs> it's summer day 14 of year one. Thank you very much. Um, this is the tempered broadsword. I'm playing- I played with the remixed mine rewards, so the rewards are different than they, like, usually are in the regular thing. Okay, I'm just here to kill more thingies. I'm trying to get my combat and mining skills up. I really need to work on my fishing skill, to be honest. I haven't really been doing much of that. No, you can't trade online with this game, Jen. Um, you can play with friends online, but you can't, like, tr like, if you made a, a single player save, um, I couldn't, like, trade with you from my single player save, if that makes sense. Um, but you can, if you have, like, Steam friends that you want to play with or something, you can play on, like, a multiplayer farm, and, the, like, up to four of you can play on a farm at the same time, and you can, like, have a co-op farm, but, um, we couldn't, like, you know, trade diamonds or something in this. <laughs> um, they don't have that. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, Doritos, I'm gonna be on Nickelodeon's live stream um, in an hour, a little bit less than an hour. Um, it's actually pre-recorded. I already filmed it like a couple weeks ago, um, but I will in fact be on Nickelodeon's live stream at 6 p.m. for the Kids' Choice Awards Orange Carpet um, in Animal Crossing. <laughs> so if you didn't know, uh, well, get ready. <laughs> Because the Animal Crossing orange carpet is today. <laughs> okay. Um, that happens at- why orange? Because Nickelodeon is orange, Snowy. That's like their brand. Um, Pip, thank you for the love month resub. Where can you watch it? On twitch.tv forward slash Nickelodeon. <laughs> I'm gonna raid them in about 45 minutes. That's the plan. Um, so I'll bring you there. <laughs> I'll show you exactly where in about 45 minutes. <laughs> um, but it starts at 6, so we'll go over there. Do not worry. Yeah, anyway, it's pre-recorded. I know I talked to you guys a little bit about how I was, like, working on something that I was super nervous about last week. <laughs> um, I was- that was me recording this. <laughs> so, um, anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna watch it, I think, Jen. I'll be there in the chat. Um, I, at least I plan to. I might leave it muted though. <laughs> I might mute myself. I'll definitely be there. I'll watch, but I might mute it. <laughs> no one needs to hear me talk. Well, you need to hear me talk. I don't need to hear me talk. Um, it's currently 5.15 PM for me, Jen. Um, okay. I think you'll like it though. It should be good. I hope. I really hope it's good. <laughs> hey, Diana, thank you.
thank you for the raid. Welcome in everybody. It's so good to see you all. Um, today, I am working on my evil Stardew Valley save. I hope you're having a good stream. Welcome in. Um, currently we are- oh, I have space in my inventory again, finally. Um, you're playing Animal Crossing tonight! Nice! Nice! How did it go? Um, but we're playing a little bit of Stardew Valley. I started this evil save on Saturday where I'm trying to, uh, <laughs> where I'm trying to do everything wrong, basically. Um, and <laughs> that's what this is. <laughs> so I'm- I'm doing the Jojo Mart route, I plan on dating everyone all at once. Like, I'm- I'm trying to ruin as many people's lives as po uh, lives as possible in this save, so... <laughs> we haven't started dating anybody yet, but we're getting really close. It's a work in progress. Also, Angel, thank you for the bits. Thank you so much. And can we get a caster for Diana Daisy's there? Thank you again for the raid, you guys. Thank you so, so, so much. Okay, I actually can give that topaz to, um... What's her face? Emily. In the bar. We'll do it. We will do it. Hey, wait, Maru. Maru loves- wait, does Maru love diamonds? Should I give this to Maru? Yeah, Maru does love- maybe I'll give that to her while she's here, because I caught her. There, that's good. <laughs> that works. Yeah, Snowy, I think we're gonna marry Abigail um, after we date everybody, and then I'm gonna have kids with Abigail turn them into doves, <laughs> and then divorce Abigail. <laughs> I'm just trying to cause as much pain as possible. Yeah, the gold bar is for Leah. I'm going to the, the um, the bar, don't worry. <laughs> um, can you marry someone if you cheated on them? Well, can I be married to Abigail before I, she finds out that I'm cheating on her, and will I still get the cutscene if I'm married to Abigail and also dating everyone else? How does it work? What? Leah's not in here. I- I didn't catch her in time. I can erase her memories and then bring her back up. I don't know how it works. We'll get the cutscene if you're married? Okay, so we can't marry her. Coop, thank you for the prime sub. Well, then they're all gonna hate me. I didn't get the gold bar for Leah in time. Oh well. <laughs> I had a, um, a thingy. But she's gonna be in her house and I, I don't know if I'll be able to- Well, I have three hearts with Leah. I might be able to give it to her. But it's 9pm, I don't think I will be- I can't. Oh, Father Bolt, isn't it so good? It's so fun. Um, I really enjoy this game. This is like my favorite game of all time. No, Lily, I haven't finished the farmhouse yet. We're gonna work on the farmhouse tomorrow. The one that we did on Thursday? Wednesday? <laughs> the farmhouse that we started working on on Wednesday? We're gonna finish that tomorrow on stream. That is my plan, at least. Um, <laughs> said like a million of the things wrong. Um, okay. I'm going to... Chop down some things. I want to waste my energy while I am still here. It's your birthday, Misty! Happy birthday! Can I sing you a song? <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> yeah, you know the, the day. Thursday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Exactly. <laughs> Eli, you can play this on like every platform. Um, I'm playing on PC, but you can play on Switch, you can play on other consoles, you can play on mobile, you can play on Tesla, I mean, any- any gaming platform that you prefer, you can play on. <laughs> uh, whatever your preferred- your preferred platform is, um, Stardew's on it. <laughs> and on Tesla, it's free, so if you ever want to get Stardew on the cheap, um, you can always buy a Tesla, and then you'll get the game for free. So, you know, if you haven't considered that, that's um, a nice budget tip. <laughs> if, you want, if you want to save some money on Stardew, simply buy a car. You know? <laughs> Makes perfect sense. Okay. 
There's even a board game. Yeah, there's a Stardew board game now that came out like two weeks ago. Um, so you can even play the physical copy on a board game now. Um, so <laughs> you can literally play this game on every platform. No, Kyra, you can't play while you're driving. There's a lot of, like, games that are on Tesla. Um, you can play, like, on the screen in the middle of the car, but not when the car's running, obviously. Like, not when you're driving. <laughs> not a safety hazard. It won't let you play it if you're driving the car. I mean, I don't have a Tesla, so I wouldn't know, but I assume that you can't actually play when you're driving. It's just, a th like, sort of like how you can watch, like, a show on the Tesla screen, too, right? You can't actually watch it while you're driving, but um, you can play when you're just sitting there, parked, you know? Waiting for your car to charge. You can watch Twitch on Tesla. It has the Twitch app. <laughs> See? <laughs> no, the Tesla thing is real. I'm not kidding about that. It's actually on the Tesla. That's not a prank. The Stardew is actually on the Tesla. <laughs> I wouldn't lie about this. Okay? I don't chat. I don't joke about Teslas. All right? <laughs> <laughs> we don't mess around when it comes to Teslas, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna go- today's, what, the 15th? I'm gonna go bring some gift pe gifts to people. That's for Haley. Pepper for Shane. I don't know if anybody loves apples, but Maru loves cauliflower. I don't know. Perhaps give some more gifts like this to people? to know. Let's go find people. No, it's not even just a stream joke. I think I should get a coop today. I probably should buy a coop. You know what? Yeah. 4,000 gold, 300 wood, and 100 stone. Let's buy our coop finally. I've been really delaying. <laughs> Snappy? Hey, what's up? Come here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Hannah, what's up? I hope you are doing well. My cat is in the room now. All right. I have an emerald, too. I might give that to someone as a gift. Oh, well. I also have, like, these. I'm giving gifts to everybody. I'm giving gifts to everyone. I come bearing gifts for all of my friends. Um, well, soon to be more than friends. <laughs> Can you have a gift too? Oh yeah, sure. Yeah. Anyway, today is the day of gift giving. <laughs> Jamie, thank you for the three months. Koopa, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you all so much. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to- yeah, Haley loves some flowers. I know. Um, ooh, cutscene. I don't want to watch this. I'm sorry. <laughs> I got this for Elliot. This is for Haley. Um, got this for Shane, Maru, Emily, um, Abigail. You know, we got gifts for lots of people here. Mark my words. I will give gifts for all, except not Sebastian. I don't have a gift for Sebastian. <laughs> Unfortunately, Father Bolt I'm on Coop is in a car, not Coop for the chickens. Okay, to be fair, easy mistake to make. I mean, <laughs> I guess that makes sense. Oh, that's cute, Danya. That's really cute. Shane, this is for you. Pepper, pepper, pepper here. I love you. We're gonna date soon. See, actually, though. <laughs> okay I can't go in there yet well I don't have a frozen tear for Sebastian it's not that I'm intentionally not giving a gift to Sebastian I just don't have a frozen tear to give him <laughs> it's his fault that he's hard to give gifts to I'm not a, I'm not trying to not give Sebastian gifts um it's just that Sebastian is a more difficult um person to give gifts to <laughs> I don't have any sashimi or a kitchen to make it, cowgirl. Um, we're only on summer of year one, so I don't have anything to give him like that yet. 
I've usually been giving him frozen tears, but I'm out of frozen tears, so I can't give him a frozen tear right now. He likes quartz and amethyst. I guess I can give him one of those. Um, I was just trying to give him loved gifts. Al Alex is way harder than Sebastian. I Sebastian's not that hard. I just don't have a frozen tear for him. <laughs> That's all. It's just that I want to give him a loved gift and I don't have one. <laughs> um, it's not that big of a deal. Goose, I'm trying to give him the best gifts possible. If I see him, I'll give him um, an amethyst or something. Personally, I like experimental noise rock. Thank you. Thank you. Well, liked gifts are easy. It's, it's the loved gifts that we want, Moonweaver. I have plenty of liked gifts I can give him. I want to give him, like, loved gifts, though. Um... Hurry up. Okay. Hello, Vincent. I'm going to give... <laughs> I know you can't see, but <laughs> I'm in bed with him. <laughs> he goes, hey, how's it going? After I jumped into bed with him. <laughs> Did I even- do I even have a reason to come give anything to Sam? I don't think so. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> Genesis, thank you for the prime sub. I'm off to go give some gifts to everybody else. Before marriage? This is for you, Haley. I know you love sunflowers. I mean, he seems cool with it. <laughs> okay, this is for you, Emily, as well. Do we have eight hearts with her yet? Oh my gosh! Wait, we can give Emily the bouquet. We can start dating her. Okay, easy. One down. Can I give her the bouquet today? Or does it have to be a fresh gift? Like, because I already gave her two gifts this week. Can I give her the bouquet today? Or can I not? I don't know how it works. You can? I'll try. I'll go buy it just to see. Oh, we've got a- we got our first girlfriend so fast. Okay, I will give her that. I'm gonna go see if I can give Abigail a present really fast, though. Abigail's in the kitchen. First victim! <laughs> that sounds terrible. She said about something about her pet guinea pig called David. Alright, we're doing great. Okay, it's not considered a gift like the rest of things, so I can still give it. Okay, perfect. That's what I thought, but I just wanted to make sure. Peyton, thank you for the prime sub. This is so easy! Okay. I'm gonna go give it to her right now. <laughs> Off we go. I'm gonna give a present to my soon-to-be girlfriend. Honestly, it's fitting, because she has blue hair. And Jojo Mart is blue. I'll accept this, thank you. I didn't know you felt the same. Eating healthy is very important to me. We just started dating and she goes, eating healthy is very important to me. Perfect, okay, easy. <laughs> oh, I wanted to give Sam a Jojo Cola. I need to make sure I follow him so I can give it to him. I guess I have enough money. I could buy him, um, he loves pizza, doesn't he? Can I buy him a pizza? I have more money now. Oh! Maybe I'll, well, maybe I'll buy Leah a, um, a salad as well. Salad, pizza. Okay, go. I just didn't want to waste money, but I guess we have a lot, so. It's, like, no big deal. <laughs> Here you go, Sam. That, I think, is one of the first love gifts I've ever given him. I don't think I've bought Leah a salad yet either. We finally have some more money, so. Oh, Harvey's there. Okay, I'll buy Harvey some coffee. Let's go fast. Harvey loves coffee. I might buy the hash browns recipe. Honestly, just buy all that. <laughs> Easy. Okay, Harvey, I have coffee for you. 
And then last is just Mario and Sebastian, which won't be too bad. Here you go. Okay, thank you. We're doing pretty well. We've given like, oh, I haven't given Elliot a gift yet. I should go give Elliot this pomegranate while I still have it. Let's go check it. Emmy, thank you for the sub gifts, by the way. And Duck Dan is okay. Thank you for the 13 months. Peyton, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you so much. Oh, thanks for hanging out, uh, Decom. I appreciate that. Have a wonderful night. I'll see you later. Enough pizza for the class. <laughs> I wish. Unfortunately, I'm I'm not sure if I have enough pizza to to go around here. Where would Elliot possibly be in the library, or would he be standing down here? Let me look him up. I'm, oh, I haven't bought my coop yet either. We need to hurry. Summer. Monday. Oh, he's gonna be in the forest by Leah's house. Let me go buy my coop first. We'll catch Elliot on the way back or something. I actually already gave Haley a, a gift today. And uh, I gave Haley a sunflower, which is one of her loved gifts. Um, so we did already give Haley a gift today. The only th only three we haven't given a gift we haven't given a gift to uh, Elliot, Penny, or um, sh uh, Sebastian yet today. Oh, I need to give I brought wait wasn't the hang on I have an emerald the emerald was for Penny. No the dime no both oh she likes melons too oh good well I'll give her the emerald. Would Penny be at the library? Hmm. It is possible to get another serious cash. You'll be okay. It sucks that you killed the first one by accident, but you'll get another ancient fruit eventually. Don't worry. Don't worry. Penny? I lost Penny! Okay, just for the record, body, I know you didn't mean any harm with this, but when you go into a streamer's chat and you say, why is the chat so dead? That's actually really mean. <laughs> what you just said is actually one of the meaner things you could ever say to someone in Twitch chat. So I know you weren't trying to do that, but that's really how it comes across. So probably don't do that again in the future. <laughs> Obviously today's chat's a bit slower than we're like building in the sims because we build in the sims. It's chaotic and to a max, but um, <laughs> It's kind of rude <laughs> um, Anyway, but obviously it's different than when we're playing sims because there's like significantly less people here because we're not playing the big scary games, so Wait, did I walk past Penny? Where was Penny? Wait where was she? By the community center? Oh. I didn't even notice. I was focused on Sebastian. Oh yeah, she's right there. By the bench. I mean, not the community center. I'm sorry. The Joja Mart warehouse. <laughs> My bad. Okay. How are we doing? I haven't given that many gifts to Penny yet, so. All right, Elliot and Sebastian still. Um, the inside is just a, a big blue Joja Mart warehouse. <laughs> so. <laughs> no, the chat's not dead. I know the chat's not dead, but. Um, I I don't really care about that kind of comment. Because obviously, like, I am used to it. <laughs> um, and obviously, I'm also aware that, like, you know, obviously my sturdy streams have less viewers than my Sims ones. Like, that's just a fact and not a thing I care about. Like, I honestly, it's kind of a relief sometimes. Um, but I warn you to not say that kind of thing to other streamers because they might ban you for saying something like that. <laughs> um, like, genuinely, people might ban you for saying stuff like that. Oh, I haven't given Rob- I haven't done my coop yet! Tomorrow. I can't do it tomorrow either because she won't be in there tomorrow. Okay, we will do it on Wednesday. <laughs> um, Rachel, you think it sounds extreme, but 
like, it's a really mean thing to say, to, like, go to someone's chat and be like, wow, nobody's here, your stream is boring. Like, that's what it, when you say the chat's dead, it's like, wow, no one's here and no one cares about you. Like, that's the context that it, um, it comes across as. I'm sure they don't mean it that way, some of them do, a lot of them do. But, like, when you say that, it's a, it's a very mean thing to say. Um, and plus, like, the streamer, if their chat is actually dead, they're probably, like, very aware of it. Um, and, like, stressed about it. So, like, it's just a, a very mean thing to do. Don't, don't say that kind of thing to people. Um, it's just not nice. <laughs> um, you know? But anyway. Yeah, it's kind of, it's, that's a good equivalent, honestly, is being like, you've got a giant pimple on your face. Like, they, they know. <laughs> they're aware. Um, if they actually have, like, less viewers or a less active chat that day, they're probably, like, hyper aware of it. Um, and, like, a little self-conscious about it and probably kind of sad about it. Like, you wouldn't just walk up and be like, you have a giant pimple on your face. Although, people in Twitch chat do that kind of thing. Um, it's just kind of mean. Like, we're all, I got two frozen tears now. There we go, Sebastian. Problem solved. Um, but again, like, I'm not that concerned about this in my stream, but a lot of people are, so I just, Twitch etiquette, you know, be careful not to, like, hurt anybody's feelings. Um, Izzy, thank you for the four months. Mallow, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you so much. All right. I'm gonna try and give this to my friend Sebastian today so that he will love me. I think I gave a loved gift to everyone except Alex today. I got a loved gift for everyone except Alex. Um, Izzy, thank you for the four months, by the way. Mallow, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you all so much. Well, I haven't given one to, um, wait. Elliot, on this day, he is returning home from the forest. Okay, we gotta catch him when he, as he's on his way home. But yeah, Alex is hard to give gifts to. I gave him a loved gift for his birthday. I found one of his snacks he likes um, in the trash, so I gave him one of those. Um, but I, he's harder to get loved gifts for. He loves a lot of food that we can't really cook yet, which is part of the problem. I married Elliot in my last save. <laughs> um, so I've got some experience with dating Elliot. I wonder if he'll be at the beach yet. How long does it take him to get back from the forest? Hello? <gasps> no. Caitlin, thank you for the five months. I don't want to watch a sad cutscene. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go check in his house and see if we find him in there. Oh wait, can I even go into his house now that it's 8 p.m.? It's, he's definitely gonna be home by now. It's probably too late. And his house locks up early too, right? Yeah, no, it's too late. Oh well, we can give, the, give it to him tomorrow. It's no worries. No worries. We got lots. We, you, know, you only give him a gift twice a week, so it's not a big deal. <laughs> we wouldn't be able to give him, like, you know, we didn't, like, lose out or anything. Jessica, I'm gonna get off stream in about 20 minutes. Uh, and we're gonna raid Nickelodeon, because the stream is over there on Nickelodeon's channel. Um. <laughs> yeah, Siren, I like Elliot. I'd never married him before. He, Elliot's a bit, um... <laughs> Elliot thinks he's better than you. Although, a lot of the villagers in Animal Crossing think they're better than you. <laughs> um, some of the things that Elliot says are a bit, like... <laughs> I don't know, it's just something about him. He's really, he's really something, basically. He's like the smug villagers in Animal Crossing. Yeah, he's a bit smug. That's a good way of putting it. <laughs> he's a bit smug. <laughs> um, did I say, what? I don't know what I said, but you're making fun of me. You know what, I don't, what did I say? The smug villagers in Animal Crossing is right. The smug t villager type in Animal Crossing is what he's like. I said that on purpose. <laughs> I was calling him smug. <laughs> um, Anno, thank you for the prime sub. Waxy, thank you for the five months. 
Um, did I call Stardew Valley Animal Crossing? No, I'm not thinking of Snooty, I'm thinking of Smug. <laughs> I mean, he's kind of snooty too, but I'm definitely thinking of Smug. Um, oh, I said some of those are hard to get to know in Animal Crossing. Oh, okay. So, thank you for the 17 months. Um, everyone's making fun of me in Twitch chat. Um, anyway, I call them Smug on purpose. <laughs> Um, call me Lube. I'll be live at 4 p.m. tomorrow. I'm usually live at 4 p.m. I went live early today because I wanted to still get a full stream in before the Kids Choice Awards orange carpet thing at set, at 6. Um, but I'll be live at 4 tomorrow from 4 to 7. Jordan, thank you for the four months also. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, Bookworm, there's a big difference in chat between teasing out of love instead of hate. I, I know the difference. I know chat was teasing me out of love just now. I always find it very stressful when I look over at chat and everyone is making fun of me for something that I don't remember doing. <laughs> like, when you, like, misspeak, I don't remember misspeaking. Obviously, you just heard me say it, but I've, like, kept talking, so I didn't realize I misspoke. And then I look over and, like, seconds later, the whole chat's laughing at me and I'm like, I don't even know what you're talking about, what's going on? And it kind of scares me, but it's, like, not a problem. <laughs> It's kind of funny, to be honest. <laughs> um, but, like, I don't remember misspeaking, and then, like, obviously the chat's delayed. Um, and then it just confuses me. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Lily, thank you for the 1500 bits, by the way. Thank you so much. Wow. 130 gold. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, we're making real bank here today. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, my spirits are in good humor today. Perfect. <laughs> it seems like you're starting to get close to some of the townspeople. If you want to show someone that you're romantically interested, you've got to give them one of my beautiful flower bouquets. I'm selling them now for a very fair price. If you want to start a family someday, this is the first step. I know, I already gave one to somebody. <laughs> Uh, come by the mayor's house to see Emily's clothing therapy? Okay. Yeah, we already did it, but, um, because we got the ability to do it yesterday. Um, Emily's just telling us about it today. <laughs> That's why. Okay. Yeah, come on. Get with the program, Pierre. Yes, it is, Pusheen. Nickelodeon things in about 18 minutes. Um, that is correct. <laughs> it is happening very soon. Okay, I want to give gifts to all the single people again. <laughs> um, I'm gonna give a cauliflower and a melon to people. Perhaps a pomegranate. Bring these. I don't know. I've got some gifts for people. Oh, I've got some presents to give out, so I will. The, the Nickelodeon stream is about an hour long. Um, so that'll be happening in just about 18 minutes. I'm getting really nervous. <laughs> Honey, I can't do the coop today because um, Robin's closed. She's not open on Tuesdays. She's going to be doing yoga today. So we won't be able to. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm really nervous. Again, I already did it. Like, I already recorded it. I'm just really nervous about it playing. <laughs> Now that it's getting really close, I'm just really scared. <laughs> I'm trying to not think about it and just game, but I'm getting really scared. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go um, kill some slimes this morning while I wait for the um, people to open up their homes to me. Oh, you're- don't worry about bringing it up. You're fine, Pusheen. I was- I mean, I've been talking about it all stream. Um, you didn't, like, do anything wrong bringing it up. Don't worry. Don't worry. I've been talking about it all stream, too. Um, I'm just nervous. <laughs> um, and now it's happening soon, so I'm extra nervous. <laughs> Kimberly, thanks again for the five months, though. Um. Okay. Any more slimes? I'm just trying to kill as many slimes as possible whenever I get a chance. Because I want my slime ring. <laughs> like, really bad. <laughs> Die. Okay. Yeah, I think you'll like it. It's gonna be cute. 
Um, I mean, it's just, it's an Animal Crossing orange carpet. Like, it's kind of, it's just kind of cute. Um, so I think you'll all like it. I'm just nervous. <laughs> um, okay. Um, that's no big deal, Nora. I don't mind. I don't even remember the person's name who did it. <laughs> it's no big deal. Don't worry. Um, okay. Um, Starfire, thank you for the six months, by the way. Thank you so much. All right, I'm gonna just get a couple of copper and then I'm gonna leave again. All right, let's go. Let's give some gifts. Yes, Dangerous Moth, you didn't know? Buying bits on PC, bits and subs are significantly cheaper on PC than on mobile because the mobile app has massive upcharges because uh, the app store on like every program, like on your, you know, Samsung phones, on your Apple phones, the like app store takes a huge cut. Um, so you can save a ton of money. Well, not even save money. You just don't have to pay the ridiculous upcharge on mobile if you pay for it in your, um, uh, on PC instead. Or like in the, um, oh, Sebastian's in bed. I'm going to wake him up and give him a gift. There you go. Love you. <laughs> but yeah, the subs are a dollar cheaper on PC because um, the app store, if you didn't know, the app store takes 30% of any in-app purchase everywhere. So even including on Twitch. Um, but I should make a command for that. Well, Space, I always thought people knew about that. Um, we talk about it a bunch. I, I'm not sure that making it, I mean, we could make a command, but people aren't gonna read it if we, even if we do. <laughs> um, that might not be a bad idea to be like, don't pay for it in the app store. But we talk, I swear we talk about it like every day because um, people don't, don't always realize um, Ooh, already gave Emily two gifts this week. People don't always realize that it's more expensive, so. Um, but yeah, if you can buy it like in the browser on your phone, instead of buying it in the app, um, you can save the money that way too. Sailor, thank you for the bits again. Adriology, Adriology thank you for the sub. Call Bear, thank you for the bits. Thank you all so much. Mad Catter, what does that mean? <laughs> what? Are you trying to be mean to me? <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure. I honestly can't tell. <laughs> I don't know if they're kidding or not. Um, okay. It said hip hop lil slimy is a B word. But they have like a thousand messages in chat, so I don't think they've decided to turn on me today, but who knows? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what did I miss? Are they trying to be mean to me or not? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's not a big deal. Um, Okay, I am here to buy pizza and coffee. Is vegetable medley a loved gift from anyone? Leah loves it. Interesting, maybe I'll buy, mm. I was gonna say, maybe I'll buy two of them. Cause then I have an extra loved gift for her. That's different. I don't know. More options. <laughs> okay. Um, hello, Leah. This is for you. Oh, didn't mean to give you two of them. Oh, I didn't bring anything for Shane. I should have. I guess we can go back, right? I love you, Sam. Here you go. Oh, so I just kept clicking on it, waiting for it to stop letting me click on it. But <laughs> Sam's just playing the guitar, so it's never gonna stop. <laughs> Oops. Um, no, I'm not gonna buy beer. I have lots of hot peppers we can give to Shane. Um, makes way more sense than buying something. If I can just give it him something I have at home that's cheap. <laughs> we have peppers at home. <laughs> I don't wanna waste the money. Um, okay, Harvey. 
This is for you. Oh, Alex is right there. Hey. Do you perhaps want this? Let me through. <laughs> it's Alex's day to have a doctor's appointment. I'm stuck. Okay, um, Mario, this cauliflower is for you. Oh, I already gave Mario two gifts this week. Philip, thank you for the prime sub. Oops. Oops. Okay. Um. <laughs> Philip, thanks for the prime sub. I'm getting so nervous. Okay, right, thank you for the prime sub. Uh, two months in a row, by the way. But yeah, as far as, like, other people we have to give gifts to, let me think this through. Who else have we not given the gifts to yet this week? Like, Shane, Haley, Penny, Elliot. Okay, Shane, Haley, Penny, Elliot. Shane, Haley. This one's for Penny. That one's for Elliot. Um, I'm gonna save that, those things as gifts for people. Uh, I have some flowers that I can give to Haley. And Shane, I have some hot peppers for. Okay, now I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> Granny Gremlin, thank you for the bits. Yeah, I, I feel you. I don't usually have the heart to do like an evil run in Stardew Valley either. So this is kind of fun for me because I don't usually do this kind of thing, you know? So... <laughs> Um, I don't blame you for not having the heart to do it, because I really don't. <laughs> okay, on Tuesdays? No, usually, um, he's gonna be in the- f Elliot will be in the forest south of Leah's cottage. Let's go there. Yeah, we have the minecarts now, yeah. Um, I've not used them yet, but I haven't needed to. I've been, like, running around looking for people to give gifts to. Yeah, Natalie, I know you can do this, but I wanted to have all my inventory things that I needed at the top. I know I can just do that to see it, but I like to have all the things I actually need at the top and not things I don't need, see? <laughs> and this is how I usually organize my inventory on purpose. Um, yeah, we have fruit bats on this save, yeah. Aw, oh, thanks, Arden. Um, no worries, I gifted a bunch of subs on Dan's stream yesterday. <laughs> I'm glad that you were one of the ones to get one. That's exciting. Here is for you, Elliot. Um, only three hearts. Not good enough. A bunch, it was a hundred? Well, yeah, I gifted a hundred subs in Dan's stream yesterday. <laughs> well, it was Dan's partner anniversary. Dan got partnered on Twitch a year ago yesterday. So it was important. Kale, thank you for the eight months. <laughs> Um, anime, if you press tab, you can go through your inventory like that. I only have two inventory rows, but um, if you press tab, you can like filter through the inventory that way. The orange carpet gem is in exactly <laughs> eight minutes. I am so nervous. <laughs> um, okay. I'm scared, 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 I'm scared. Oh, here's Penny. I gave you a gift. Thank you. Um, does Penny love me yet? We only have three hearts. It's okay, it's better than no hearts. And I think Haley might be down here. She's on the beach a lot in the summertime. No? Oh, she's probably standing by Alex at the ice cream stand, maybe. I don't know. That uh hot -huh, she was. She's right there. Love you. <laughs> We're getting so close. We have a lot of hearts with these people. This is big. Okay. Now, last but not least, gift for Shane. Easy. Snack run took too long. <laughs> oh, Maggie, what did you get? What snacks did you grab? Shane's up here. Here you go. It's your birthday. Can you get a song? Yeah, Sophia, for sure. Almost there with the eight hearts, almost. We're at seven hearts with Shane. I guess I'll just go mine a little bit for the rest of the day. 
We still have like five minutes left of the stream. Oh my god. I'm so scared. <laughs> my heart feels all racy. <laughs> and I got like that, you know that like really like that nervous like pit in your stomach? <laughs> oh. Sophia, thank you for the four months. Amissa, thank you for the bits. Micah, thank you for the prime sub. Kale, thank you for the eight months. And Father Bolt, thank you for the bits. Um, yeah, you can link to that in, v in VIP, Father Bolt. I'd like to see it. That'll be fun. Oh, okay. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. I'm fine. <laughs> okay, so if you missed it, um, the Kids' Choice Awards are tomorrow. They sponsored our stream yesterday, but they also um, are doing like an orange carpet in Animal Crossing, um, like in advance of the Kids' Choice Awards to like celebrate and stuff. Um, and they asked me to host it. They asked me to host the Animal Crossing orange carpet. And that Animal Crossing orange carpet is on Twitch in five minutes. <laughs> Um, I already recorded it. It's pre-recorded, so I don't have to like hop over and go live right now or anything. Um, but I'm still scared. <laughs> I'm still really nervous about it. Um, but we're gonna raid them in a second, so don't worry. I'll I'll show you where to go. I'll take you there. Um, I will bring you exactly where you need to be to watch it if you want to. Um, but I'm just really scared. <laughs> I wonder if they're live yet. Do they have like a starting soon screen? Perhaps. Let's find out. Um, they're not live yet. They'll probably be live soon. <laughs> um, so we'll find out. No, yeah, I'm hosting the, uh, the orange carpet in Animal Crossing. It's just like a little silly, like, you know, people like awards shows have red carpets. It's like a silly little red carpet thing, but in Animal Crossing. Um, I didn't sing the birthday song. Oh, did I not sing the birthday song? It should be around an hour long. I don't know how long they ended up cutting it to or anything because they like obviously they edited the recording a little bit um, But it should be around like an hour long I'm so nervous <laughs> I'm really excited about it though. Obviously like working with Nickelodeon is like the dream Like I you can't get cooler than that. That's like the coolest thing to do at all ever like <laughs> You really cannot go wrong. I mean, well, what am I saying? I don't know. Anyway, Nickelodeon's great. I'm really excited about it. Um, I've been very excited about it. It's a really cool thing. I'm just nervous. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna kill some stuff because they're not live yet, luckily. So we still have some time. All right. Let me go all the way around. There's like a bunch of barrels. And there's an open ladder right there too. Soon you'll have your own Netflix show? What would my Netflix show be? I mean, that would be fun. You work if you left from their studio? Oh, that's so interesting. Um, that's actually really cool that you work nearby their studio. Um, I don't. <laughs> just looking at Zillow? Well, I get a Netflix show where I just browse how- I no, you know what? I tour houses and I make fun of them. But in real life. Like, like houses for sale, like new builds that have like really expensive mansions. I go like tour these really expensive mansions in Los Angeles that cost like $20 million and I make fun of them. <laughs> yeah, that'll show them. <laughs> I'm just like, well, you know what? The kitchen, horrible, disgusting, hate it. Honestly, I'd watch that if someone did that. Oh my gosh, speaking of uh, weird TV shows, my I saw this thing on Netflix yesterday, like a brand new Netflix show um, that they're airing, and it's called, um, oh my god, Marriage or Mortgage is the title, okay? I'm gonna go home and I'll talk to you about it. So in this show, Marriage or Mortgage, it's like a real estate agent and a wedding planner competing to see that a couple has like a sum of money and they're either gonna buy a house or throw a wedding. And then like the real estate agent shows them some houses, the wedding planner shows them like a dream wedding and then the couple picks. So the first couple, I watched one episode last night, they had $35,000. They were moving to it, um, like Nashville, I think. And they were like, well, we're either gonna use a, this for a down payment on a house or spend the full 35K on a wedding. Either or, 
they it, they're, they're not gonna just like spend half on the wedding and then keep saving for a house no they're gonna spend the full 35k on the wedding so the then, then they like have to pick between house or wedding i'm sorry there is a right and wrong answer <laughs> Why, like, I know people want a dream wedding, but, like, if you had a lump sum of money and you only have that one lump sum, what you, why do you have to pick between a house or a wedding? Why can't you, like, <laughs> why isn't there, like, an in-between? I don't understand why there's not an in-between. It just makes me, I don't get it. I don't get it at all. I really don't get it. <laughs> like, a home or a one-day party? Which would you prefer? Anyway, I just, I couldn't believe my eyes, basically. And I thought you all would be interested in that. So it's on Netflix. <laughs> I'm sure that, you know, you'll have a great wedding day. I just, I feel like if I had to choose, I'd probably pick the, the mortgage. Especially if you're going to spend, like, your entire savings on it. Like... I don't get why you can't, like, have a wedding, but also keep saving for a house. Like, why can't you- <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> like, why do you have to spend all of your money on the wedding? That's what- that's what doesn't make any sense to me. Like, why is the wedding budget the exact same as your down payment budget? Anyway, Nickelodeon is not live yet, so don't worry. We're gonna- we have to obviously wait until they go live to, um, to raid them. But, um, it is in fact 6.01 p.m. So, <laughs> it's happening, oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna, um, keep saving all this stuff. I wonder, I probably could, oh my god, they went live. Oh my god, <laughs> no, they went live. <laughs> Look, <laughs> it's my character. Ah, okay. Chat. I think it's time. I think it's time. So if you didn't know, uh, the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards are tomorrow. They sponsored us yesterday, but they also asked me to host their orange carpet and Animal Crossing. And today is that orange carpet and Animal Crossing. In fact, it's right now! That was good timing with the day ending in my Stardew save, by the way. Um, oh my god, I'm so scared! Okay, well, we're gonna raid them, um, so that you can watch. So I'll- I'm basically raiding myself right now. Like, I- I will be there. Um, <laughs> I will be in the stream. Obviously, it's pre-recorded, but I will be in the stream. Um, it will be my voice hosting the- the orange carpet. So let's go over and say hi. Don't spam too much. Don't be weird. Let's not scare Nickelodeon. <laughs> um, but make sure you go tell him I said hi. Um, I'm so nervous. I hope that you like it. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is my first hosting gig. Um, so this is a big moment. <laughs> um, and I think on that note, um, I guess I'll catch you all tomorrow. Are we ready? Is it time? Are we going? It starts in seven seconds. Okay, I'm going. Oh my gosh. 